Hello, hello! My name is Lily Moon. Welcome to my channel. If you're not new here and you don't know what's going on, well, I hope you, you enjoy the following content and I hope you look back if you enjoyed this video on my old videos and I hope you enjoy those. If you're not new here, you know the gist of what's going on. I kind of already explained in the last episode what this episode's gonna be. It's actually gonna be Life is Strange 1, episode 2. So before we get this going, I recommend you grab snacks, drinks, a blanket, a pillow, just relax, lay down, whatever you feel like doing because this episode is going to be extremely, extremely long. The last Life in Strange episode was about three, almost four hours long. That, it was a lot. There's a lot of dialogue. There's a lot to see. There's a lot of you know, reversing time and bringing it back. If you're ready, strap in. This is going to be a long episode and I am kind of excited for it. Um, so in the last episode, we met Chloe, which is Max's best friend, who she hasn't talked to or seen in five years. And Max did a little bit of no-no. And the last episode, we found out that Max has been at Black Mill, uh, Black Mill, Blackwell Academy for a while, five months was it? I don't remember, but at least a, a couple of months and she never contacted Chloe. That's a little, ooh, I can understand Chloe being upset about that. I'm a little iffy when it comes to Chloe because she's, um, she obviously has her own issues that she needs to focus on and needs to uh, grow with. Uh, her dad did die that we found out and her, it's just her mom and her stepdad who her stepdad is weird he's if you know if you, you know in the last video who he is if not you should go back and watch it to learn more but his, her stepdad is weird i don't like him either he's a little creepy but i don't this is probably really gonna anger a lot of people i'm not a big fan of chloe yet i said yet this may change it's only the first episode so it may change but um my favorite character so far is kate actually and i know she's such she's a side character so we might not see her as much but she seems like such a genuine good person max i don't mind herself she's just a regular old teen so we're gonna get this going hopefully we'll learn more in the last episode I showed a preview of a train and chloe so yeah we'll see how that goes but yeah let's let's go let's get this going let's hope this is a good episode let's hope i get everything i hope I find everything, I hope it goes well. But yeah, strap in, make sure you got your snacks, your drinks, anything you would want for this possibly another three hour long episode. The previous episode of Life is Strange. Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Preview time. Do it up. Little pieces what of the But he could be talking about photography. Or have you done something wrong? Talk oh, I don't like the hey, pencil either. Victoria. What do you want, Max? I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. I'm glad we helped Kate. Reals, Warren, this is between <gasps> you and me. <gasps> oh, I, I, I skipped it. Oopsies. One one character, I didn't. Really, I meant to pause it. I do like another character, Warren. He seems really cool and I really like him so far. Um, I hope we get more of him. Uh, he seems to like Max, but Max doesn't seem to like him. So I don't know. Oh, Being a superhero is dirty work. I need a shower. You need a shower, girl? I'm sure. Use? Whoa. Hello, zombie face. This is what happens when you research quantum physics all night. Oh. Uh, Chloe? Oh, Chloe. I mixed up Chloe and freaking uh, uh, Victoria for a second. What is all of this? You guys are typing a lot. Okay, they're not typing, so I can talk now. Chloe, you there, hippie? What about that f snow? I forgot not to cuss. What about your new power? Or have you gone back in time to fi and figured it out? I can't go back that far, smart ass. Too bad, you can't go back and warn me about that joint. I thought saving your life was more important. Boom, Max delivers that final blow. But for reals, we need to talk. I need you standing with me on this. Or eat an buster breakfast at two whales my treat it's good to have minions got a bail got a bail master breakfast to go you there mad max like i said always for you no emoji <laughs> meet me at the diner in 40 i'll be there do not be late or i'll know time is not on your side after all after all you did did let step door bust me Hold on a second. She told me not to get out. 
of the closet. Does it that she would get in more trouble if I was there? And now she's using it against me. Oh, oh no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What? On my way. You are evil. Forty minutes or else. Oh, because she used the, the um, emoji. Mom. Oh, last time we talked to mom, she principal title not well not told told on us and apparently we're lying. Hey, honey, I hope you didn't forget to water that plant we gave you, but don't drown it either, mommy. Aw, she sounds like such a nice mom. <sighs> Guys, prepare. It's reading time. I don't think I read this yet, but I probably have, but we're gonna read it again. <clears throat> Hello, snooping deeper, I hit the paranoia of jackpot and found a whole mini surveillance setup of Chloe's house with cameras in the halls and some rooms. Truly creepy. What kind of uber paranoid puts cameras throughout his own home? A lot of people do actually, it's actually pretty smart, but it is kind of weird for him. Chloe's stepfather, I guess I see why she's got serious attitude. When I got back upstairs, I couldn't fix the stupid camera, but Chloe saw the butterfly photo and knew I was in the bathroom and set off the alarm. Her attitude totally changed and she realized that I had saved her life. Even though it could have gone the other way, she was so happy like when we were kids and it was great to see her face light up. She even gave her me her dad's awesome old in Instamatic as a symbol of our reunion. She cranked up the tunes and started dancing on her bed like a maniac. She even got me to shake my booty, just a bit. That's when St Chloe's stepfather showed up and it was David Madsen. First off, I would like to say, I don't know how Chloe figured out that we were in the bathroom with her because the picture was just a butterfly on a bucket. That could have been anywhere. Second, it took her a while to realize that Chloe's stepdad was David Madsen, especially since we found so many clues that was him. <clears throat> I had to hide in the closet and then David came in, angry about the music. He was even scary off campus because he didn't have the school around him. He accused Chloe of taking one of his guns. Then got real. David found Chloe's joint and flipped out on her. She didn't back down and he actually slapped her. Oh, I think I did read this. I thought Chloe would be pissed if I didn't step in to help, but she didn't think it would matter. We decided to get out of there and catch up on exploring, like friend, like best friends. So Chloe and I ended up at the lighthouse watching the sunset. Chloe was mellow and told me more about David and his uber paranoia at school and home. It all made sense. But I wanted to know why Chloe was in that bathroom with Nathan Prescott. She told me he deals drugs and she wanted blackmail. She wanted to blackmail him to pay off some big loan. It's so strange where our lives have gone since the last time we hung out when we were 13. That's so, that is crazy. Then I had another nightmare or duskmare. I was right back at the lighthouse in a storm, except this time I was following a ghostly deer until I got to the edge of the cliff. I could see the tornado destroying everything in its path. And again, I could feel the cold sting of the rain. The lighthouse was crumbling and I felt so helpless watching the tornado move towards the town. Then Chloe snapped me out of the dream and I told her what I saw. And as if to make the day end on another unusual note, snow started falling from the sky in the warm sunset. It felt so weird, ominous and beautiful at once, especially standing there with my best friend. And on that positive thought, I have officially earned a great night's sleep. Girl. Oh, we might not want to get that yet. This is look. Good morning, clothes. I hope you slept well. Now, shall I be my Gucci shirt with the Vuitton jacket? Girl, you have like no clothes. <laughs> uh oh. I wonder if I'll ever wear a watch again. Oh, it's cute. I remember when I used to have watches like that. Just because some pranked a girl's shampoo bottle and her hair fell out, we have to safeguard our toiletries. So, summer camp. I would, are you kidding me? I don't want anyone else using my toiletries. I mean, okay, Max, unless let's hit the showers now. Okay. Meanwhile, my guitar gently sleeps. I'm sorry, I'm not playing that. What if it's a copyrighted now song? Now I have to wonder if any of these films are based on a true story. I don't know what they are, but, um, oh, let's look and then we'll make the bed. This totally reminds me of being a kid in my room. Sorry, mom. I can make my bed whenever I want. Booyah. We're making it. I am so not a rebel. I always like my bed to be neat and tidy. Thanks, mom. <laughs> she literally, what? Uh, what's the sticky note say? Look. I can't keep my eyes open, but I know there's a scientific answer. 
Okay, these are these are good. I like the way they, you know, she draws in this. It seems really nice. Uh, bull, I'm drowning in time. Time is like a river. Einstein, giant giant frog. Why <laughs> my head hurts after longer rewind and thinking about this now. The laws of thir thermo excuse me dynamics can obviously be broken. So no rules, only guidelines. Burn your clock. Uh. Rewind only limited by time itself. Right now, I only have enough time to go back a certain amount of time. Irony or evolution. Maybe I have to do time exercises now. Take a giant step backward for mankind. A uh, book? I could rewind for days and read all of these books. Will I really find any insight into my power? That is true. This picture will capture this crazy historic moment in my life. Take a selfie. No smiling. Take your power seriously. You can smile. <laughs> she took a picture like a mom would. A Facebook mom. Um, look. <sighs> I could get lost doing time travel research. Wait, I don't understand. Your search engine have become one. If only I could be this focused on homework. I don't understand why she wants a new laptop. This one seems to work fine. Warren is blowing up my inbox now. Holy as long moly. as he helps me figure this out. <clears throat> Reading. Whew. Too much time. Warren Graham. Hey, Max. The doctor is in the house. I've been thinking long and hard about your weird request. I just sent you a bunch of physics and science links. And without further ado, here's a few time travel films you must see. I'll send more as they come to mind. The doctor expects a full explanation for your newfound chrono interest. The Time Machine. The 1960 version fun early steampunk sci-fi and morlocks faces melt primer lo-fi time travelers in dallas brilliant i'll explain it to you after you watch it time after time hg wells uses his time machine to chase jack to chase jack the ripper to modern day Sa san francisco super cool and clever pulp fiction serious the switching between timelines gives a good basic outline of reality Relativity. I don't know if I said that right. Plus, plus Uma. <laughs> Somewhere in time, a big cult around this romantic sci-fi written by Richard Matheson. The best kind of chick flick. You'll cry like a baby. I did. Uh, the slip. You can borrow my copy of this awesome Japanese flick, or we could watch it together. Sony Chiba and his soldiers end up back in samurai days, basically tanks versus ninjas. Time Cop. John Claude Van Damme does the splits on a kitchen counter in his underwear. Need I say more? That's all the time I have now, as I do have actual quantum physics to plow through, and not your fun back to the future homework that I never get. Now that you've discovered the art of science, I expect you I expect to see you in the lab more as well i could always use a new partner in time get it don't hit i'm leaving doctor who this is so insane it sounds logical to me warren's funny i like warren what does this all say oh <sighs> join the chrono knots time travel is not just science fiction history has recorded numerous cases of individuals who have managed to bend all rules of time space quant 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 Continuum. The present dilemma is that those who ha can navigate temporal dimensions are rightly reluctant to reveal themselves due to the impact of public and government scrutiny. Nations around the world have spent literally billions of dollars trying to build, in top secret, their own versions of a time machine. Thankfully, this is not a case where infinite revenue equals control to the infinite. Or you might not be reading this website at all. This is where the chrononauts enter the picture. It's clear based on the vast scientific information that the time travel is only applicable on a person by person basis, not driven nor dominated by any one particular physics or thermodynamic calibration. For this reason, we have created a forum where past, pres present and future time travelers can share tips, ideas and experiences to guide those navigating the rocky seas of time. Hence our moniker, the chrononauts, Brave solitary adventures of on an infinite voyage. Register within the forum and step into a river of time without fear of being swept away. Okay, okay. This wormhole thing makes total sense, but 
doesn't explain how I can do what no scientist ever has. I'm sorry guys, I, this is so much to read. Wormhole, welcome to the wonderful world of the wormhole, a term lazily overexploited in science and science fiction. For neophytes, visualize a wormhole like an individual tunnel from one end of space to another. Thus, if wormholes exist, time travel is possible and probable. The human trick is to discover the means or device needed to link and traverse at both ends of this time tunnel. Einstein's theory of relativity po posits that this is within the realm of theory, while a new generation of phys physicists, I don't, I'm sorry, I'm screwing up words and I'm sorry, but moving on, hopes to develop an actual working model of this fascinating space-time conundrum. Inside Wormhole are links and articles re relating to the most recent develops, developments of this fluid theory. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm gonna mess up a lot of words because I don't know how to say them. I would say this is some crazy sh but now I'm not so certain. Should I sign? Okay, I have to get comfortable. Why are quantum physics trying to control time? Physicists? I don't know. As you read these words, and scientists around the world are using taxpayer-funded government programs to shatter our notions of time and space, potentially altering the course of history itself. For example, Australian researchers are using photons to simulate quantum particles as they travel through time itself. Even though quantum time mechanics is a very recent theory first predicted in 1991, it has caught fire within the scientific community who eliminated ethics and morality from their dangerous exp experiments. And I thought I was into Halloween. Okay, this is Dana the last is one. not messing around here. Dana knows what's up. Gold Days Halloween Party. Bring it, Blackwell Bloodsuckers. Next to prom night and Bigfoot Ball. My favorite time of year is the annual Gold Days Black... Black... Black Halloween Pate. What? Picture me busting a thriller zombie move. <laughs> Principal Wells has given us almost, car almost carte blanc to decorate the halls and gym within taste and safety. So I want every student to be scared you know, blank, when they walk to their classes. I know y'all have tons of homework as I do, but let's make this a Halloween that Blackwell will never forget. The decoration committee meets in the gym at 3.30 next Wednesday, October 10th. This gives you plenty of time to not have any excuses for flanking. And if you don't show up to help haunt the halls, the boogeyman will get you. Let's show Blackwell our goal power. Pleasant screams, Dana of the dead. Dana's cool too. Okay, now that we've read all that, okay, sticky note. Let's water this plant. Drink up. It's got electrolytes. Got electrolytes. Sounds like me at the end of all my videos. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. If you don't like that, let me know. It will have consequences. Why will it have consequences? Gordon, seriously, do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. I am oh. so on it. Consider it done. They told her to do your own crap. What is wrong with her? Okay, we did that. Oh, there's a new Halloween thing. Yeah, missing poster. We know who the missing person is. Okay, the forks. Brooks room? What am I? No brook here. Why would I knock? We already saw. Okay, one thing I will say, we did go through all the posters. So, uh, I don't have to go through them. Be the change you wish to see, Gandhi. Okay, she, I know she's in here. Okay, Fine, just- I won't disturb you. You're nice, cause I'd be like, I know you're in there. I, I literally saw you. Oh, well, bang for God, no. Well, let's see what she says about it. The We're racing that. I'm erasing that. She does not deserve this. I don't know why they do this to her. Can we write something else on it again? No. I want to check on her. What Kate happened? is an early bird. She might be up and gone. Wait, what happened? I said, why am I kidding? One quick rewind and I could stop this TP attack. Did she get hit by something again? How do I rewind again? I don't even remember. Ow! 
born. Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. <laughs> She's so funny, is she? Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. Why is she always getting hit by something? Now we gotta go erase Kate's, uh, uh, thing again. But that happens to her quite a bit. Oh, I, I was I was hoping it would not give us I it better give us the option to race again. I would have been really upset. Okay, so we knocked. Okay, posters. We know. Love you, mom. Wait, what is this? It's, so it's a girl. Hey, this is the girls' dorm. Ooh. The Vortex Club are such pigs. I'm glad I pissed them off. I didn't think Kate was like this. Whatever they're watching gross. must be hot Ew. stuff. We shouldn't be watching this. There's Brooke Everybody's looking smarter than everybody. Why is he talking about my girl Kate like that? Uh-uh. I don't do that. What are you watching? Taylor is no doubt being led around by Victoria, as usual. Okay, I don't know why I read that. We've already seen all that. Why are they making fun of my girl Kate like that? Who's Stella? It's one of the other girls. Go away! People sleeping. Sorry. Geez. Clearly not a morning person. Well, this room's open. Okay, Dana. Uh, can you tell me? I've never seen Dana this bouncy and happy without a pot of coffee. Dana, can you tell me what's going on, Kate? Okay? Okay. What's happening, Dana? Everything cool between you and Juliet? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thanks again for releasing me from her captivity. By oh, the way, uh, the best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. Oh, that's, that's awesome, interesting. Dana. Okay. At least Wait. we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Wait. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your b Warren. Uh, I'm not Warren's big good. On cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So. Are you coming to the party or not? Oh, why not? She she wants to be more social. Not? If I hate it, I can Stop always go cussing. back to my room. <laughs> I gotta edit That's that all out. That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a rave. It does sound like fun. Now I have to go contemplate my party future. Wait, what's wrong with Kate? Why? Why? I'm. What's the paper ball? Do I look at that? What? what? This is both sad and pathetic. Wait, is this the one? This is what I was gonna talk about. Um, 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 yeah, we've read this before. This is the same, though, that's Logan. Two different guys. Oh, okay, so this is a new guy. Trevor's Jack, she must be with that this new so guy. That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. Yeah, I I currently have so much, I have so many plans for all Halloween's coming up. I have so many plans to decorate. I'm reusing all my boxes. Trevor is making himself comfortable. Ugh, hope they don't get busted. I hope they don't get busted either. Like, he was just in here. I can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess. I don't see why, but okay. Rollerblades. Oh, I wanted to be a derby girl, but I almost broke my feet just putting them on. Guys, I can't even use the ones with four wheels. Maybe I'm better with the one stripe. I hear some people like that. Curiosity killed the Max. I'm, I'm gonna do it. Who will survive and what will be left of them? <laughs> Don't say that out loud, dork. Okay, this is Dana. It says relationship status, not single. Happy, happy, joy, joy. And she's happy. That okay. would be fun to put skulls and ghosts all over Blackwell. Okay. Gold. Oh, we already read this. <laughs> we don't have to. Like, I could pull this look off. <laughs> Hello, Victoria. Zero, zero to 20. 150 dollars? I mean, I get it. It looks high quality. I don't know. I want someone to tell me what's up with Kate. Hmm. What was that about? Oh. Speaking of Halloween, oh. look at all this makeup. At least Dana knows how to use it. Yeah, you, you learn, you practice. What did that say? Wait. Is she taking birth control? I don't know if that's birth control or, or 
Do we speak to her again? Let's talk later, Max. Okay, we don't talk to her then. Um, I think we saw everything in here. Uh, she wants to take a shower. That's what she wants to do. So, hey, can you tell me what you just saw? Yeah. Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? Why? Why should I? Because it's hilarious. Church girl gone wild. Kate's not like that and you know it. Yeah, you tell oh, her. Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary, Sex, Tell her! Luna? Tell Touché. her! Now I feel like an you ass. You should. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. You should. If I Zachary would have Victoria, are you sure? What about Victoria? What did you do about Victoria pulling that crap? Nothing yet. My mind works in devious ways, too. Glad to see you're back in action. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Yes. Or pass it on. As That's yes. Spirit. Thanks, Juliet. I don't sure. know what this... Talk to you later. I don't know what this video is, but she doesn't deserve that, whatever it is. Hey, Brooke. Oh, hi, Max. You look distracted? Did you see the snow? You look distracted. You look distracted. She did. Everything cool? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. Oh, she's gonna I mention I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Oh yeah, she likes Warren. I will later. I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll see you around. This is so sad. So Brooke likes Warren, who likes us, and we like Skater Boy, she said. I can't think of anyone else. Okay, so that bathroom didn't work. What's down here? Kiko, we already read all this. this oh, we can, oh, this, yeah, shut up. Okay, okay, okay. You hear my squeaky chair? <gasps> okay, oh no, she's being, wait, let me look around first and then, then we'll talk to Kiko. No, I want to talk to her right now. I don't care what else. Let's look at her first. Kate is not good. I wish David would get off her crack, as Chloe would say. <sighs> Let's see what happens. Hey, Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Anytime. Oh. Hi, hi. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, she said she did. Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Squeaking. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? Mm -hmm. I just need to take some notes for class. She's... Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. <laughs> I don't... I hate this. She looks so sad. Like, you could tell she's been crying. Oh, someone's in there. I don't want to go in there then. With her. I don't want to see it, but uh oh, she's come off. Wait, where are you putting your clothes then? Maybe she just puts it over the door or whatever the curtain. We have to watch this hotel. Really? Really? Oh, we're paying okay, what's this? What's up, Kate? I cool. swear, I swear. That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. No. Victoria, so what? isn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Yeah, I'm gonna make oh, you sorry. Oh, I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Ooh. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up, and you know he has the good sh preach it. Nathan, so Nathan, he probably drugged her like yeah, he did Chloe. I goddamn paint all over my face. Good thing my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. We ran all the way. Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. You can hang out with Kate or Matt. Pop up! I swear, I swear, she makes me so mad. 
I don't care if we were good, kind of good terms yesterday. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. You just I hate insecure. that. I'm so quirky. Crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. Why are you stopping her? Such an evil biatch. I love it. I'm. I hope we can get a chance to erase this when we get out. Because <laughs> Max isn't getting coming out. How do you remember that to begin with? You're obsessed. She's obsessed. I don't. I cannot stand. I cannot. Who acts this way? Yeah, let's go, Matt. We need to delete something. Give me control. I'll read that in a I second. I better get dressed and go give back Kate's book. Um, erase that. I don't even want to look at it. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Sorry, I forgot. I didn't even know you were in here, so... Why would I look at the sinks? What's that? Oops. I forgot about the water pressure. Oh, that was it? Okay. Oh, there was a... there was a... thing. She wrote two more! Two more! Okay. <clears throat> I'm sorry. I have a bad reading voice, so I'm sorry, you know, with that. But I also mess up words, so let's hope this goes well. <clears throat> October 8th. I woke up this morning a different person, even if nobody knows yet. After yesterday's intense revelations with my rewind power and saving Chloe's life among the other cray-cray, as Victoria might say, events at Blackwell, I have to assume everything is different now, and I thought exposing my photos to the world was going to be hard. After Chloe dropped me off back at my dorm yesterday, I tried to find out more about that freak snowfall that happened when we were at the lighthouse. But the local meteorologists are stumped so far. I feel so jacked up that I pulled an all-nighter on time and physics research. Okay, next. Not being Warren and I end up- wait, not being Warren, I ended up- knowing less about my situation than when I started. I don't really think that my tornado vision and the snowfall are connected, but at this point I have no clue what to believe. I'm just so glad Chloe and I are a team again. That has to be destiny. Not- now- Rewind. Now I have to hit the showers to get ready to meet Chloe for breakfast. Lord knows I need it. I ran to Kate in the showers and she asked for the October Country back. I love that book and definitely need to get my own copy. Of course, when I was in the shower, Victoria and Taylor barged in and totally started bragging on poor Kate about the video. Just to be complete a-holes. They, they, they wrote the link in the mirror. I truly don't understand how they got off on acting like that. How, how they get off on acting like that. I understand that. I don't get why they act like the, the way they do. Victoria has everything. What does she gain by being a bully to Kate Marsh? We're supposed to be adults here, but I swear it's like Battle Royale, just without this, just without the dystopia and exploding heads. Only Victoria can make me feel dirty in a shower. My poor girl Kate, she doesn't deserve any of that. More? Oh, no, that's saving. Okay, I can't believe that says that. Okay, we gotta get the book for Kate, I believe. Um, let's go get it. Shift. Wait, can we talk to- Oh, we pop- we have to get the book first, don't we? Ugh, no f way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. Who wrote that? And I that? still have to clean all this crap up after I find Kate's book. Me and Victoria didn't... Oh, sh Nathan's revenge. Nathan? Even Chloe told me not to go to the principal. I don't care. I do not care. No, nobody messes with me. You're messing with the wrong girl, okay? The wrong girl. Me and you, Max. Um. Oh, we had to search the papers to find it. No book here. That. That was a quick search. I will say. Maybe it's. I think it's in this one. Maybe? And nothing here. Oh, so it had. 
Why does she put a glass on her papers and stuff? Oh, it's on the corner. It's not bad. <sighs> of course she just spilled soda on Kate. Oh, of course. Book. And then she puts her papers. this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to her list of problems. Okay, I don't quite understand the power yet. I don't know how far I can go. I don't have to Be stop gone, it. Foul, soft drink. In the midst, like I'm quite confused with it, but aha, you sneaky book, you're mine. Wait, she didn't change. Can we change? Oh, there we go. Get dressed. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week, and he couldn't even rewind time. Oh wait, is that another? No, I keep checking because I'm scared I'm gonna miss. Okay, so let's now go. Now I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. Okay, let's go take this to Kate. As if I have to worry about being late anymore. Chloe can wait. I do have all the time in the world now. I am sorry. Literally, Kate is going through so much right now. I'll read that after we're done talking to Kate. Kate. You in there? Yes, I'm here. I'm in that. She sounds so sad. I'm, I'm sad. Kate's my favorite char character, and I don't like that. I like Kate and I don't want to do this, but I need I need to Kate is up. all alone dealing with this video bullshit. I hope her mother doesn't disown her. I forgot the way her parents are. Okay, I hope not. Okay. <sighs> Ari, call us. Kate, your father and I just received a rather disturbing call from Principal Wells about you and some party video. Our concerns about sending you to Blackwell seem justified. Please call us after your classes this evening so we can fully discuss this matter. We hope you haven't brought shame on you or our family. We'll pray for you and expect you to pray for your forgiveness, your mother. <sighs> she doesn't deserve this. She really doesn't. I really do not like the fact that people treat her so bad. Kate used to play the violin every morning. She stopped last week. You're gonna make me cry. That's so sad. That means she's not happy anymore. I can't blame her, to be honest. Kate's art is perfect for a children's book. Everything looks so fun and colorful and- It does look cute. Positive. Uh, sorry if you hear my stomach growl. I haven't ate yet, so- Why did she cover up the mirror? She can't look at herself? No, I hate this. I hate this. Kate really has a doting father. And the light shines in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. John 1, 5. Katie, you'll always be my brightest light against the dark. Hugs and love, pop. Miss Kate, March Blackwell Academy, Arcadia Bay, Oregon. Dang. Um. That's a lot of tears. She's going to go through boxes. There's a photo right here. Can I look at it? I had no idea that Kate ever hung out with Alyssa and Stella. Oh, they seem not. No, she looks happy. I'm gonna beat everyone up. She's a bunny. That is the cutest bunny ever. I bet Kate is a good mommy. I bet she is too. To be honest, she seems like she'd be a good, a good person out of it. Ouch. She left out amnation. Oh. Auntie, dear Katie, no spirit or devil could have prepared me for what you have done in that videotape. And like a Jezebel, you released your harlot image before God's eye. I will pray with my church for your soul to be saved from eternal hellfire. Auntie Marsh. You can be part of my family, Kate. It's okay. It's okay. More drawing. Good Lord. This must be Kate's H.R. Geiger period. It's because she's not happy. Okay, let's talk to let's look at her first. And then Poor we'll Kate. She doesn't look good. Kate, you're my favorite. Um, hey Kate, I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? Because you don't deserve that. I hate bullies. I had no choice. Now you had no choice. I hate bullies. I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I Seriously. was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you I care do. about me. 
Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid a He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. We already know everything, so... I'm gonna say why. I want why her to talk to me. That? Because he saw the video. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Can Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have uh -uh. no memory. We heard, we heard from Victoria that Nathan drugged her. Doesn't sound like you. That's awful. Why'd you go? That doesn't sound like you. It doesn't sound like you. I can't see you partying with Victoria. I didn't. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Oh, don't Did bother you me with questions. I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. Not enough to get wasted. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I, I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did That's somebody true. drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Mm-mm, 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 no, no. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was uh, being I nice for a so. change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite She's of too nice. nice! What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... Ooh. And... I hate to push her. She's in such a... Such a... A moment of weakness right now and we're just questioning her we're not we're not her therapist or anything we shouldn't be pushing her this far if she doesn't want to say anything she doesn't want to say anything but i want to ask her are you sure she knows she knows what she just told us that's what she thinks happened if, if that's what happened that's what happened and that's all i remember i don't know what happened see she i woke up know. outside my dorm room the next day i didn't have any marks or bruises but i felt gross so who took the video of you at the party i have no idea Probably, probably Victoria. Probably she was, was there being her mean self. Victoria. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. I would speak to her again, but I know- oh, I didn't realize there was more. I know she doesn't- Most of the time when you talk to people again, they say go away or and I don't want to talk right now. Kate's room is usually immaculate. For her, this must be a pigsty. She's going through so much. I cannot blame her. Her family's talking about disowning her. It's way too emo in here. Uh, Kate isn't that gloomy. Until lately. Wait, so having your cringe drawn all the time is emo? My whole house is like that. <laughs> That's rude. I just don't like the light. Damn, it's the all-American zombie family. Ooh. So I'm assuming sisters, dad, and mom. I'm gonna fight your mom. Make Kate you even makes nice. notes in her Bible. My parents never once took me to church. I had nothing to rebel against. I don't know what to believe now. This isn't my place to say. I'm not a religious person. I don't read the Bible. I'm not into any of that. So I did go to church as a kid though. So I, it's not like I was never, you know, brought to church. I just not into it. But this is what her family and what she likes, you know? So I feel like people judge her. They they use the, uh, we'll bang for Jesus. Or they said, or Victoria even said, um, or not Victoria. Uh, not Dana, but her roommate, her the one that thought she was her boyfriend was cheating with Dana. But she even made a comment about a uh, church girl gone bad or something, and that to me amazes me because she doesn't harm anybody with 
what she believes and what she wants to do and what she likes she just puts up a poster that says you know join if you want to join but i've never once heard seen her say anything about it or you know push anyone to it so the fact that everyone's being so mean to her about something that you know that she likes is crazy to me it's crazy to me and not only that apparently this video i swear if i was in this i'd, I'd be i don't fight but i'd fight okay matthews eleven twenty eight. come to me all you all you who are weary and burdened and i will give you rest matthew eleven twenty eight. proverbs when you just what proverbs twenty one fifteen. when justice is done it brings joy to the righteous but terror to the endeavors so proverbs and matthews seems like she really likes those ones but she crossed out proverbs so maybe she just really likes matthews one maybe kate has a split personality church girl by day party monster by night that's not split personality she she this is the one time she's gone out of the house she's at school in a dorm instead of at home this is probably she's learning new stuff i don't get this safe not sorry no matter how much you like each other one slip up can change your life you have a choice there's nothing wrong with waiting there's nothing there is nothing wrong there is nothing wrong with waiting um she's not that that she literally just told you that you know she was drugged 100 this th this video isn't she didn't do this intentionally she wouldn't do that to even to so herself max can i ask you a question and please be honest absolutely oh, my heart, my anything heart hurts. i need to find out if nathan prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. i think he hurt her to be honest Regardless, it, he was with Should somebody I go else. go to the police? His family knows everything. On one hand, if she goes to the police, there's evidence that she went to the police. But I feel like we should look for proof. And then go to the police. Because then we have proof. They can't deny. I say look for proof. We have time on our side. I say look for proof. If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against yeah. you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. Ooh, I'm just telling you how the cops that. in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. I no, know, okay. I'm okay. sorry. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. Yeah. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? Yeah. I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be mad that she's talking to me like this. Because she's obviously really hurt and she feels hopeless. Good job, Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. We do. Jesus, this is intense. If Kate wasn't out of it and is actually telling the truth... Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she smiles. I'm assuming these are sisters. Youngest, you know. Okay, so that's it. No, I, I'm not, I I like that answer because she may be like upset and she's just taking, she needs to let it out. And we're the one person that's talking to her. We're the only person that's talking to her and checking up on her. So like, yeah, she's gonna act like that because she's mad. Oh, okay, we read all this. Okay, private number. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything or I'm coming for your A. I know where you sleep. Nathan, cause he wrote, delete my number, delete my private number. Oh, hold on, hold on. You're telling me he wants to threaten me. And not only that, not only that, he wrote on my wall, but he doesn't have the nerve to text from his own phone number. A private number? Not so big and bad, are you? I- oh, I- shit. Now I'm- Max. Food. Two whales. See you there? Don't hurt your fingers texting. Yay, breakfast. No emoji. Why doesn't she like emoji so much? Getting anonymous threats? It never ends. This has to be oh, from Nathan. Way. It but is. it could be anybody. No. I better be doubly careful around here, or I could be in serious danger. Why can't we speak to Brigitte? If I'm not already. 
Really, Max? Really what? Why are... I don't get them sometimes. I'm gonna lower this a little bit because it seems kind of iffy. Okay. Okay. So we're supposed to be meeting up with Chloe. It's Samuel! Samuel! Okay, I'm remembering. I like Samuel too. He seems really cool. Okay, first off. I'm gonna talk to... Did we just look at... Rachel, oh. I don't think I've actually seen Taylor alone without Team Victoria. Yeah. Let's Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Just because you were nice to Victoria doesn't mean I have to be nice to you. Why? Let's not fight. I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, let's just talk. Yeah. For once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment, so talk. Girl. Victoria's gonna know we talked about her. I wanna ask about Kate. We need proof. I'm gonna ask about Kate Vincent. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Maybe she'll feel bad. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll she, live. I've never seen her once talk to anybody. She'll live. Victoria, I'm gonna Why ask her. Why do you hang out with Victoria? She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. Yeah. And she's bossy too. Look, you don't know her. I do. Do you? And she's one of the best friends you could have. No, she's not. Bossy best friend. I guess I've had mean, bossy best friends too. Better than having mean, bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. But whatever. Oh, We've had our She's time. going through some. Woman. Wait. What does that mean? There's more dialogue? Can we go back and there's more dialogue? Will she remember any of them? Though? Okay, well, let's speak to her. Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Space, skip this. Ooh, let- I'm not about to ask about it. I don't want to- You're funny. Oh, never mind, Taylor. That was a great talk, Max. Let's not do it again. Now, if you'll excuse me- Oh! We have to ask her right off the bat? That seems a little insensitive, if you ask me. Hi, Taylor. Huh? I've heard I that your mother like was this. sick. I'm so sorry. What what happened to her? Well, if you do care, my mom had back surgery. Oh, okay, okay. Victoria was there for me. Oh. Like you are for Kate. I'm not about tearing people down, Max. You I know. literally tear people. That's why you I tear, to tear talk. Kate down. I'm glad we did. Oh, that was a good thing. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, but she's like, I'm not about turning people down. You only talk trash about Kate in the bathroom. Ugh! I hate. I forgot about that. Okay, well, let's run. I don't like this. Ooh, what's this? The paint job looks great. Samuel knows his color schemes. Sam, so I'm gonna talk to Samuel last. I just wanna check out what's here. Ooh, what's this again? Why would you turn that on again? Axe. Samuel really should keep this locked. It's yeah. a waiting accident. Wait, especially with and Nathan? It's easy to sneak into. I've never seen Samuel wearing shades. Sammy Stone. And what's with this other crap? Oh, it must be things he just finds around the... Mm, aw. I can see that Samuel's concerned, but does he need a poster? How did Samuel get photos of Rachel posing? Wait a second. I don't want to judge him. I don't. Um, oh, we could ask about it probably when we talk to Samuel. I'm kind of glad we came in here first. Okay, um, why would we turn on the water pump? Or why would we... Oh, we just look at it. I definitely won't play with this thing again. Okay, so that's it. So we can ask him about that. I like that wood food waste how hard is it to dump the trash into a bin but i could use this to attract squirrels release the kraken come on squirrels time for your 15 minutes of fame oh she wants a picture i better not get near the bench or the squirrel won't take the food should we be farther
Wait, why would it? Let's take a photo now before it runs away. Yes. Another Pulitzer for the portfolio. He was like, you took a picture of me? Full exposure. Okay, okay. Oh, we have pictures. More journals. Let's read these before... <clears throat> The plot thickens. I can't get out. So after listening to Victoria and Taylor rag on Kate about the video, I came back to my room to find this creepy photo montage. Only Nathan would be this disturbed. The thought that Nathan was in here actually setting up this weird gallery in a way is effed up. I better start being more careful around here. I almost want a surveillance system now. As if things weren't dramatic enough, I got a creepy text from a private number. Nathan? Victoria? No clue. I really have to start watching my back. It's definitely Nathan. I still had to give Kate's book back, so I went to her room. I knew she wasn't doing good, but I didn't know how bad it was until I went in. All the lights were off, blinds closed, like some emo goth den. And Kate is the opposite of emo or goth. She was just crying in the dark, and it was so sad to see her like this. More sad is that I wished I could take a picture of her framed in her expression, expressionist misery. That is more sad. Why would you say that? Not once have I ever seen any of my friends be really down and I'm like, this would be a good picture opportunity. Max, get your, get your, your man straight. Kate admitted that she thinks something more happened to her than just a video. Plus, she told me that Nathan Prescott gave her a ride from the party to the ER and she thinks he did something to her, but she doesn't remember what. It's hard not to believe Kate considering what kind of person she is and what kind of person Nathan is. I've seen for myself exactly what that effer is capable of. Of course, Kate asked if she should go to the police and the principal. I felt like absolute, but I told Kate she shouldn't go to anybody like until she has more proof she was drugged. That video doesn't help her case at all and this could all backfire big time. She's going up against the whole Prescott empire, not just one rich white boy and on dope. She wasn't too thrilled by my answer. I don't think she trusts me to be the one investigating all this. How can I blame her? I sometimes wonder what I'm actually doing besides getting myself in more trouble. Kate even booted me out of room. Hello, everyday hero. No, that, I think she's thinking about this all wrong. Uh, well, at least this little section. She, I do agree. Uh, Prescott has, Nathan Prescott has this whole whole the principals under his wing his family the possibly the police everybody everybody the prescott's paid for the paid for the school so i'm not surprised but i don't think she doesn't trust you to investigate it i think she's just i think she's just lost she doesn't she under, under, she's feeling a lot she doesn't understand what's going on okay so what is this football can't Blackwell have at least one no football zone? Wait, now that I think about it, why were they playing football in the front of the girls' dorm? Is the boys' dorm not cool or something? <laughs> or maybe we have more land. Okay, let's talk to see. Oh, pretty. The birds are flocking around Samuel. He's feeding them. Ah, there's Samuel, up early. Already communing with the critters. I don't want to judge him. I feel like he's actually genuinely hey, Samuel, guy. I think this is a mystery. Early. Oh, hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. It actually is. I'm not. I can feel like the animals right. waking up with me. Uh, let's talk about everything else That's before we bring up Rachel. I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. Whisper? What animals do you see in the forest? I, yeah, she did. I saw a doe. Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me. Like it was trying to communicate. I oh, like that. That's your spirit animal. Nothing weird there except you saw yours. Aww. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> what do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. Samuel seems cool. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Yeah, it was Another a little message weird. from the Earth to get our shit together. Samuel, cuz I, I wasn't Samuel expecting that. Hasn't seen anything like that before. I agree with him though. Okay, let's talk about. Rachel. Sorry to pry, Samuel, but why are there photos of Rachel Amber in your shed? I'm curious about her. Sorry to pry, she says while prying. 
Now everybody wants to know about her. I just came here. Some people care. I know people who cared for her. People who are looking for her. If she can be found. Like you. That's the nature of mystery. It's no mystery that you have her pictures. Yeah. She gave out headshots like squirrels chasing food. Keep on prying, Max. Sounds like you have a lot of time on your hands. Oh, he didn't I like so that. don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. He didn't like that. Of course that. you will. I mean, I can't blame... Oh, let's look. Let's see what she says about that. Ah, there's Samuel. Up early. Oh. Already commuting with the critters. So... So, yeah. So he didn't answer... Oh, she was giving out headshots, he said. It's Warren! Hold on, Warren, sorry. Oh. This is Nathan's father. This is a message to let you know that attempts to slander and blackmail my son will be met with many lawyers and legal ramifications. You're not the first student at Blackwell to try this. I hope you're the last. Consider this a final polite warning. You know what I think about that? You and your son. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Not sorry. Let's talk to Warren. Max, come on over here. You're not even looking at me. Why'd you say that? Warren is out and about already too. Oh, how's his eye? Looks like he's waiting for somebody. Girl, you know, you're so oblivious. He's waiting for you. Warren, what are you doing here? Oh, nothing. Ooh, I I'm forgot about Warren. For a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. Thank you. When you By the way, way Thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. He was. Oh, you. Oh, no. yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully, and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, I'm she's sorry. pretty punk rock. How do you know her? Just a pirate? That'd be kind of cool. I'm gonna tell him though, I trust me. An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Except she parked Which wrong. Which begs the question, why is remember. Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? I feel like we can trust... Ah, I feel like I can trust Warren. I don't think he would tell anybody. I don't think so. I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. He's not. He's You're not. fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday. Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the oh, Apes marathon. Oh, drive-ins are so rare. Let's go ape. Yeah, why not? I don't see why yes, not. that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. Oh, okay, Warren. I see you, I see you. Wait, do we go this way? Oh, okay. Warren likes her so much. I just could tell she doesn't like him. Or at least she's oblivious. She doesn't think about it much. He's not the skater boy that she likes. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel. This is the one time I'm okay with David talking to him. He's like, he d Nathan deserves it. Nathan needs help. I personally think. Oh, it's that guy that we saw in his portfolio. Wait, we're taking a bus to Chloe? What kind of school? I mean, maybe she's just coming off and around the stop, but. There is no music here. None whatsoever. Oh, he walked away, he walked away. Okay, can we check our journal? Okay, 27. Okay, I ran into Warren, or rather, Warren was waiting to run into me. Naturally, he wanted to know what the was happened, what the hell happened in the parking lot with the Chloe and Nathan Snow. Once again, I felt like a, I don't know if I want to say that because I should have gotten a hold of Warren to see if he was okay after he we just left him in the lot. I do owe Warren. Yeah, that's true. She never contacted Warren to see if he was okay. 
Uh, I only told him a little about what was going on with Nathan. The less he knows, the better for him. I would love to at least tell him about my ability to reverse time and space. But ironically, I don't think it's the right time or space. Besides, he would want to marry me immediately, just so he could have his own human time machine, or capture me for scientific experiments, or maybe go to the drive-in with him. You said yes to that. That's mean. Oh wait, I did say I would go to the drive-in with him. Hope he doesn't make a lame move on me. Not that he would he would egomaniac warren and i do have a lot in common but he's like a super geek brother anyway i definitely need a movie escape he's like a brother i am sorry warren you have no chance before catching the bus out to meet chloe i saw nathan talking to david which made me nervous otherwise i had a nice soundtrack ride to the two whales diner did you know uh, talk about going in and t back in time. I haven't seen the diner in five years, but it looks exactly the same. Although now there are way less fishermen and way more dumped food carts than when we were kids. Chloe and I had the best backdrop to play pirate. Old ships and a big ocean. It's a little weird that the, the bus dropped off, but it's probably just such a small, ta small town. They kind of just drop off the kids wherever. Or maybe she asked him, can you stop, or, yeah, him, Don't can you try stop to here? take it from me. It's mine. I wouldn't dream of it. She wouldn't I'm dream of it. I'm a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. I bet he's seen a lot of changes to Arcadia Bay in his lifetime. No him. time for chit-chat. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. Waiting for the bus so I can cash it in. Well, you got it. She looks busy and stressed. Hi. You look lost. Close. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The online schedule isn't working. Didn't we just gotta get off? No, that's the Blackwell Academy. I'm confused. No, he's waiting for it too. I don't know. I don't know. It runs pretty regularly. I cannot miss this job interview. But I've got to take the bus out of Arcadia Bay to Newport just to find work. Are things that bad here? Where are things good? I can't even afford to live here. Oh, that well, sucks. Good luck. Thanks. I sure need it. I, I understand that. It took me and my fiance uh, looking around. We got lucky. Our two bedroom, uh, two bath place is 550 which isn't bad uh a little tore down but we can live with it um tab then uh messages chloe running late grab a booth at the diner mom will feed you oh she wanted to you know bombard me with messages but she's like somebody better i'll be lucky if you make it at by noon okay so i wonder if we can find out for this lady when the bus comes um, flyers, save our city. Okay, what is he? Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Restore the lifeblood of Arcadia Bay, save our bay. End the man-made drought in the bay. This is still a common issue, let's be real. Okay, let's look at him first. He looks like a photo of the classic Arcadia Bay crusty fisherman. Wow, way to be rude to him. He's RJ MacReady. Good morning. Mac looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Has the cha town changed? Yeah. Has What's the town changed him? much? By Neptune's beard, it has. Seems like a lifetime ago <laughs> when I was king beard. of the harbor. Your own boat? You did good. You did pretty good to have lasted this long. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat. So the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. Of course. Prescott family. The Prescotts have a lot of power. They might rename the town Prescott Bay. Ew! If that tells you much. Yeah. Do you know them? They own my school. Do you know them? Do you know them? Do good for my working kind. I know them through their bad deeds. Why is my belly itchy? Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. 
We just smell that way. I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. He seems nice. I have to go in me. Let me look, let me look at everything. This is a parking lot that I can just explore, right? Hey lady, just take somebody's Wait, there's a sidewalk. Ooh, wait. Hold another universe. Chloe did that, 100 percent I don't want to go that way. I just wanted to explore. Ooh. Okay, maybe let's walk and now run. Okay, nothing over here. <gasps> Dog! Oh, stop that! Stop! No barking. There was something creepy about that guy and his dog. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, in the preview! This is the guy we saw in the preview! There's that dirty RV from the other day. The other day. I don't remember this. At the school! I do remember, because we wrote this. Obviously, nobody took my advice. Wow. That's crazy. Why was he at the school? That looks like a grown man. Open. Man, that smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware oh, uh, makes me feel 13 again. We can look at weird lady. I always wonder what people think about when I eat alone. Well, let's speak to her. Hello there to you. Such a beautiful day, eh? Oh yeah, it's gonna be a super day. Enjoy your breakfast, eh? Um. You too? <laughs> oh man, I bet that's the same gum from when I was here last. Ew. This guy has serious cojones. Join the costiest, I don't know how to say that, sorry, all day sea adventure. Now charter the legendary seaman for her own ocean voyage, Jack. Okay, I am not reading this. This is just joining stuff. Gotcha. Same, this is probably the same thing. Why does that so not sound fun? Explore Acadia Bay the right way. Discover exciting history on the high sea. Journey in total safety and comfort. Moby Deck tours. I didn't realize that. Fully equipped 40, 50 foot vessels, day and night trips available. Couples, groups, or families welcome. Tuesday through Sunday, hours 6 a.m. through 7 p.m. Visit us on the web to schedule your tour now. Oh. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to do that. I, I highly doubt we're ever going to do that anytime soon. I might make Chloe check this out with me. Sasquatch field trip. Explore the wild woods of Arcadia Bay with respected cryptozoologist Chuck Pierce Jr., author of Bigfoot, Myth, or Science, and Bigfoot, Monster, or Sasquatch, narrator of the documentary Bigfoot, I Believe in You. Join Chuck every Saturday and Sunday for the full half day of hiking to the sites where Bigfoot is most likely to appear. Chuck will share his extensive knowledge of lore, legend, and fact, and you'll end the day casting your own, very own Bigfoot print based on an area known only to Chuck Pierce Jr., Course. For more info, price, and detailed schedule, please contact Sasquatch Lives at Sasquatch Lives at wildtracks.gu. Oh, that's great. What's this? The poster doesn't mention whacked students with guns. Global excellence in arts and science for over 100 years and counting. Oh, so they've been around for. Oh, wow. Jeez, that scared me. Missing. What is this supposed to mean? Kate Marsh loves you long time. That better be not be a mean thing. I will fight. Flush before pissing on floor. Ew. That graffiti has been here forever. Oh, so I'm hoping they cleaned it. Gross. Another? Rachel A owes me a PJ. So does your mom. What is wrong with people? I guess we take a picture of this. What does he even say? 
fire walk with me? Dude, look. No, that guy looks unpleasant. He looks like he's drunk. What do you want? I feel like shit. too much beer, so spare me, please. Just let me I suffer knew. quietly. Okay, I will. Look. These fishermen are so damn quiet. He's Did you catch mean. any big ones today? If by big you mean none, then sure. I caught a lot of big ones today. I'm sorry. Now let me mourn over my eggs. You're not even eating your eggs. Isn't that French toast? That doesn't look like eggs. No, that's her mom, isn't it? Right there. Oh. That officer looks nicer than wannabe cop David Madsen. Probably is. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. No. No, I've been here many times. It's like a fourth home. <laughs> I wish I could make the two whales my first home. Joyce making rocket coffee so and mom. juicy burgers at a time. Mm. <laughs> you look about Chloe's age. Oh, so he knows Chloe. Chloe. So you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <sighs> Poor Joyce. Just heard she even just got busted with pot in her room. We're gonna say that's not good. Uh, We're gonna agree with that's him. That's not good. Anyway, hmm, that bacon sure smells good. Is she a friend of yours? I know her. I know her. Then you know she's a handful. She can be. She I can, can agree. Be, but she can also be a good friend who shows up when you need her. Sounds like you're a good friend. I wish she would be a great daughter and not cause Joyce so much stress. Yeah. Uh, Joyce. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our, our mother. Okay. I guess I think you're he friends wants with David. A wife, <laughs> I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? Just curious, he has a reputation. His reputation. He kinda has a reputation at Blackwell. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. No, he did at not. The station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> not everybody can be a cop. Okay, he's, he's not I wrong. have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. I literally just... Why is Paul The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up my coffee and get to work. Okay, okay, cool, cool. Seems like a cool guy. I wouldn't last one day as a trucker. Those rigs are too damn big. I agree. I don't feel like talking right now. I gotta deliver a load of breakfast to my stomach. Over I now. was I was not expecting that voice. I'm not gonna lie. Truckers have such a romantic life. Always on the road. I mean if you were. Uh hello? Pardon moi, but you're in my eyesight. Let's just say sorry. Oh, sorry. That's okay. I just need to see my truck out there in the lot. Been a long oh. night in the road, and I have to make sure my baby is sleeping right. I get you. Sorry. I'll, I'll move out of the way. Can I speak to you now? <laughs> I'm not in the way. Okay, so... So over here. There's more people to talk to, but right now I'm just going to keep looking around. I so. want everything. That all looks really good to me right now. I'm not going to lie. Wall of Fame. <laughs> Forgot about the fishing wall of fame. Not anymore. That's a big fish, I'm not gonna lie. I got you, babe. <laughs> How apropos. But no <laughs> way. Okay, gotta stretch. I, we can't hear it, but I'm gonna turn it on. Let's turn on guitar tune. Okay, picture. Whoa, Ken Kesey with Joyce? That's so perfect. To Joyce, best burger is a gentle vibe in Oregon. Further, okay. Okay. Picture. That's funny. Our family never went well watching. It looks fun. Oh, I'm assuming, yeah. Um, there was someone to talk to. Some guys over here. It's Justin and Zach. Is that his name? Trevor. Yeah, that's who asked. Just someone talk to me. I remember. Trevor looks as happy as Dana did. 
I, I will say this. That's one th mystery to me. I went so far back. I talked to two different people before I talked to uh, Justin. And then I still couldn't get an option to talk to him to say, oh, I know this, this, uh, this, I know this kick clip or whatever. He just kept saying, go away. I don't talk to basically posers or anything like that. And I was like, how do you remember? Hey, I'm Kevin. so shocked. Holla, Max. By the way, I know you saw me in the dorm. No. No. No, I actually didn't. Thought you were staring right at my face. I guess you know now, and so does Justin. <laughs> we How did, did see Justin him. react? I got him blazed. He was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. I see you in class, him. Max. See you later. I, I, we did see him, but he didn't. Justin he didn't. Such a mellow dude. Let's see What's up, Justin? Getting my coffee on before I cut class and destroy some rails. He's talking to me, okay? Shouldn't you be taking photos? I am. I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You crack me up, Maxer. Okay. Of course I'm baked, so I'll laugh at anything. You should be studying, bad boy. So where's all your homework, schoolgirl? School. Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. They are across from each other. finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. What? He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. Why are you guys talking to me like you guys aren't across from each other? You weirdos. Okay, I think that's... Oh, I wanted to see... If we can find anything about... Wait, I didn't... I don't think I've seen this before. Good lord. Talk about apocalyptic. My mouse wasn't working really good. Welcome to Pan Estates. Prescott Development invites you to live within the woods. Affordable luxury homes, forest, ocean, and lighthouse views coming soon to change the way you live. So they can gain more money, I'm assuming. Okay, so that's it. I kind of wanted to help that lady. I was hoping... I was hoping I could get, like, when the bus came for her, but I don't... Because it wasn't our bus. There was no way. Is there more writing? No. Okay. There's Joyce. I wonder if she recognizes us or not. We walked around the whole place and she didn't say nothing. Well, she couldn't. And there she is. A lovely she young does. woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. Nice so it's far. nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> Like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. She is pretty. We're safe, kid. You're still smart. But I wish you'd been here to help save Chloe. She got busted yesterday smoking out. Again. I know. I know. Chloe told me that her stepfather hit her. Not told I'm you were sorry there. that was your introduction to David. Is she, he should have hit her. I to know him on your terms, not Chloe's. I have. He's a good man. He just... Yeah, I'm sure he is since you married him, but don't be so harsh on Chloe. It's good you're Ooh. here. Ooh. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Um, I know she's going through a lot. That's the way I know she things is, were hard but... for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't My call. arms did you know? Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Yeah. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Hmm. She has changed. She wasn't the same. What I've seen so far. Chloe must have changed a lot during that time. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, <gasps> running away, <gasps> drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I see why. I mean, why? Yeah. What did Chloe tell you? No, I've met him. David hit her. Well, she told Chloe her that. texted me that David slapped her yesterday. He feels awful, and he does will he? be punished. But okay. Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. 
he paid his dues in a war. Uh, he does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. I don't know about that. It is no season here, but should I mention Kate? Should I? Because I will defend my girl. He cares about Kate Marsh? David mentioned her, but I stay out of his business. I won't patrol Blackwell, and he won't cook at the diner, you know? I saw him arguing with Kate. I thought you might know why. Yeah, nice I Nice try, know. Nancy Drew. But next to you, there's only one student I'm worried about. Dang. And she's not even in school anymore. So, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? Bacon omelet? Be... Oh. This is gonna sound bad. I'm not a big A person. A waffle. I haven't had the a good waffle. The last good Belgian waffle I had was here when I was 13 years old. So. Bro, right waffle does sound really good. Now finish right now. your coffee. What if I don't like coffee? I do like coffee, me personally, but what if she does it? Okay. She still hasn't got here. One Belgian waffle for the hungry girl, pronto. Thank you. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Uh, well, for the time, this probably is a lot more. Than... I old nerd graffiti. Warren must have been here. X minus Y equals Z. Oh yes, black coffee. You okay. will be mine. Okay, look. The lighthouse looks so mysterious. I wish I could stay in this moment forever. You see that wind? I, guess I actually can now. But then it wouldn't be a moment. Like you had plenty. Stick with the bacon. My hair was in my face. Okay. Yeah, it is definitely mysterious. Okay, let's drink our coffee because we still got it. What's the waiting for Chloe? Order ready. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. Already? I that keep that? going back in time. That waffle cooked quick. What, what kind of dive is this? Dude, you don't need to drink anymore. Okay. Incoming. Okay. Okay, I'll take I my waffles. I can hear your stomach rumbling from here, Max. My stomach here, is rumbling. you'll love this. I'm drooling like a baby. Yeah. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, oh. Is that Speak her? Of the devil. Yeah. Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. No, you're not. This is my treat. To you, for coming back to rescue my daughter. Nobody needs to rescue me. Unless oh. you set your room on fire smoking out. Oh god, here it comes. Didn't you and Sergeant Pepper already read me the riot act last night? Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. Hmm. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. I mean, I can't believe her mom for being mad, but at the same time, you she says some funny same. stuff. Another reason to blow this town. What is this? Oh, she's nice. Bus? It's a guitar. I put it on. Also, uh, that that's out of the way. I don't talk about. There's nothing on there. Let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation, and I can't explain why I saw that crazy fuck tornado. Come on, that's just a Link dream. Rich. I want proof you can rewind time. Proof? This is all happening so fast. We'll start proof. slow. Right here, now. What? Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. No, you again. X-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. Oh, what does she have? You give me my notebook. Okay, I Max. Thought... Impress me. Um, I don't know. People always have keys. Let me let me get my notebook, just in case. So let's say she says yes to everything. Uh, keys. Your car keys. Duh! Way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Razor blade keychain, skull keychain, bullet keychain. Uh, bullet. She has a necklace. Just like your necklace. That was so. Wrong, Max. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Okay, we had to remember something. I'll write it all down just in case, but... That was beyond epic fail. 
You made me want to believe you. Look. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. Panda. Sig. She has seven sigs. Um. Money. She has two for six pennies. <laughs> And two nickels, no, three, four, three quarters. What am I, I'm stupid. Three and one nickel. Okay. A warning ticket? There's no way they'd have me go in detail. Uh, ticket. Nine, 21, 13. 10 34 a.m i doubt they would ever make, i doubt they're gonna ask me any of this uh parking bay uh c frank franklin street i'm not writing the twin people whatever okay let's rewind got this max now rewind and blow chloe's mind This is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Um, let's go with keys again. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. A panda. Describe my keychain. I did write that. Penguin, it's a panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. Bam. You do have that Irish luck, Caulfield. Oh, what, what else? else? Um... The cigarettes. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yeah. Next. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? How? You're lucky I wrote that down. Seven. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Okay, cool. nothing else. Amazing. I mean, I wrote something else in my pockets? Money. Hmm. Some money. Clearly, I'm rich as f How much do I have? Uh, pennies and stuff. Okay, okay. Three, six pennies is six cents. Three quarters, so 75. Plus six, plus a nickel, five. 10, 16, 86 cents. Bam. 86 cents. Mm. That's right, living large oh. in Arcadia Bay. Wait, so well, let's see what she cool. has to- Show me the, more. This, she really asked me what all, what's all in her pockets. A parking ticket. You know me well. But what is the exact time I was busted? Uh, 10 34. I don't even have to look at my nose. I remember. 10 34 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time. Uh, uh, I'm not good. Yeah, believe me. Bam. Oh, bro. Oh, that. I literally just got chills all over my neck. Mm hmm. Hey. You have powers. I. I've been had power. Take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. What can I have that meal? That looks like way more than just the wa the waffle. Probably a French toast, How's the food, bacon. Max? Better than I remembered. Very good oh. save. Oh. I'm hungry. Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. I'm freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. I will predict the future. No way. You don't need to believe me. I literally now, predicted what- pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? Huh? You're Please. a bitch. Don't slap me, bitch. They fight. Take your fight club outside. Doesn't go outside. He started it. Oh, I'm God. finishing it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Crazy lady gets up. This is this is sure the hell better than that other Plug garbage. On the... I think ah. our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. Okay. So, what are you waiting for?
Talk now, about it. pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. I think I remember everything. She got up. I think I got everything. Cool. Do you see that red? I'm going to predict. Four I don't know if I can remember. That will Four. happen in the next uh, 30 seconds or so. Jay drops her plate. Cop drops his glass. Trevor drops his glass. Trucker. He drops his mug. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? Alert on cop's radio and he leaves. His partner leaves. The Wait. cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and his partner in the car leaves without him. He did. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin and Trevor fight and Joyce beats them. And Joyce stops them and Joyce doesn't care. She stops them. Justin and Trevor are fighting and Joyce breaks it up. This yeah. is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. Decor goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. A fly, butterfly, and not a butterfly. The trigger didn't place. I think it's a cockroach. Are we gonna get this the on the first try? The goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. Oh boy, oh boy. I don't want to do that again. Okay, there Joyce comes out. The, the, I know the trucker drops them up. I just know it. Oops. Did you break another cup? Oh, wait really? Go, Mom. No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You called. He him. leaves. He's off to go bust some skaters. Hey. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. They fight. Your fight club outside. He started it. Hey. I'm finishing it. Maybe. Trevor and Justin must be in love. The cockroach. Oh. On the jukebox. I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. Yes. This isn't a toy, Chloe. That's I true. I do have to be careful. It's not a toy. It. Yeah. That? Of course it's a toy. The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened. Grow up. This is why I don't like Maybe Chloe. you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's f***ing insane. We have to play. No. I don't have time. You did not just say that. Uh, check out Dad! your nose. Too much blow? Hey, are you okay? Too no. much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then, let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your powers. She has a bloody nose that she wants to test graduate. her powers? Okay, what is wrong with her? Show me the way to Chloe's cave. I cannot stand Chloe so far. I'm sorry if Chloe is your character that you like so much. I cannot stand her. Let's read. There was a, uh, uh, what is this? Joyce. <clears throat> Talking to Joyce Price after five years was almost as intense as seeing Chloe again, especially right back in ye old Two Whales Diner. That clinking of silverware and the smell of sizzling bacon rewound me back to the be being a kid. Hanging out there with my parents for breakfast, I remember her always smiling at Chloe, even in mischief. Doubt she smiles at her he hijinks now. But they still banter like mother and daughter. I moved to Seattle so soon after William died that I never saw how it affected Joyce. I'm glad she's not peed at me for being selfish and never looking back. I still remember the last time Chloe and I saw him alive. I wonder how often Joyce relives that day. That's the worst kind of rewind. One you can't control. But if I could go back to, to that moment, I would do it. Oh, what would I do? I can only imagine how Joyce ended up with David Madsen. Talk about opposites. You can tell she loves him, disturbing as that sounds. Maybe she just wanted more structured life for herself. Obviously it didn't work out that way with Chloe. I hope they both treat her right. Joyce deserves the best. Oh. Okay, nothing else here. Okay. Um, um, I don't think we all talk to anyone anymore, really. Uh. Yeah, I think we just leave. Okay, Supergirl, let's go to my secret place. 
Oh, Don't me. even answer. We have places to go and people to do. Come on, before mom starts some more let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Black. Oh, Black I'm Black. answering him. You don't call um. me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So go ahead, chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with too. Okay. I'm answering that. No hesitation. Are you kidding hey, me? She's being bullied. What's up? Please. Screw don't let you, your Chloe. Best friend get in the way. You okay? Bye. A bye. Shh. I She's making me Kate. mad. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. It's a call. I really don't think I'm going to this right now. I'll call you later, okay? No, talk to her. She needs someone to talk to. Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate, please go outside. Go you are ridiculous. Yeah. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now. You are ridiculous. Let's rock. She is ridiculous. Not only is Max having issues with her thing causing her nosebleed, she still wants to test the powers. Sucks that Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. I'm not going back. She can she can be mad. I do not care. I do not care. Ooh, ew, why do you look at us like that? Is that more writing? Yeah. <clears throat> so much drama and I haven't even finished my breakfast. Finally, Chloe showed up, more bubbly, bubbly than I would have thought after almost getting killed in a bathroom yesterday. It makes me happy to see her smile, but that smile meant trouble, since all she really wanted for, was for me to show off my rewind power. So I did, and I have to admit, I feel like a total boss, except I did start feeling weak and woozy the more I rewound. I even got a nosebleed, which kind of freaked me out. Chloe always wants more, so she demanded we go to her top secret lair. That's the problem. She... She sees how it affects her and she still wants to keep going. She still had to get pissed off at me because I dared to answer Kate's call. I'm not a fan of Chloe's petulant side. She tried to make me feel like an A, but screw that. Kate was so happy. I, answer I answered and I actually felt worse for her. Chloe has to know and I have two friends at once. Yeah, like, what is wrong with her? Kate's going through some real bad stuff. And she, she doesn't deserve it. You, you got mad at me for, and you took me here. Is I this a race? Keep up. How many times are you going to get pissed at me this week? That depends on you and how well you do in this phase of the test. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Uh. Raw and rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back and she's also super sized. We don't know for how long. Exactly why it's time to have fun. David might be a douche, but you did steal his gun. Yeah. Is everybody armed in Arcadia Bay now? Only the ones who shouldn't be, like Step Dildo. Until oh, now. Don't I'm not in the that. revolution yet, Che. You are the revolution, Max. So we should figure out how to best use and abuse your power. No. I can't. Great. I don't like Chloe. Yuck. You are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Beer and guns? <sighs> nice combo. You can Seriously, handle it. yeah. Now go find us five bottles. Pretty please. I can handle it. You can shot. I'm not doing... Fine. And this big... Gosh, this is gonna take forever. That's not safe. Okay. Nothing over there. This is her truck. Oh, why did it light up like that, though? I don't want to go that way. I was going behind the truck, but okay. That works. So we know that's where we came in then. Um, look at that. No way. I totally remember going there when I was a kid. I loved the hush puppies. Now the um, sign is just Arcadia Bay junk. That's sad. Okay, so let's run a little bottle. Look what we have here. A cute little bottle for the taking. Let me guess she's too short. Oh, no, she got it. Stupid bottle. Break time. So, 
I don't think there's any way for us to save that, to be real. Maybe I can use this to reach the bottle. Oh. Okay. Let's go move. Break time. Break time. She didn't do anything, did she? Okay, let's get that bottle. The bottle. Got the bottle. Okay, that's one. Hello, bottle number one. Five. One more to go. Look. It's so sad to look at a grounded boat. I wonder who owned that and where they are now. Somewhere. Let's be real. Oh, this is a bus. It's hard to believe that was once on the road, filled with dozens of students. This is this is a very uh beyond repair. Ooh. Rest in peace. Yeah, poor camera. Okay, so let's see. Um, I feel like we should go this way. I wonder how many generations of fashion went through that washing machine. Probably a lot. I hope they check the uh the um the compartments and stuff for it, because you can buy money in there. Boom. That's Only two. three bottles left. Um. Okay, there was something over here. A car wreck. I wonder if Chloe thinks about her father when she looks at all these smashed up cars. That is depressing. Okay, what did Warren say? Um. Let's see. Uh, is Dr. Graham in the house? A serious science question. I make house calls for you. What up, pup? Puts on serious science face. Pup? Pup? What do you know about relativity, wormholes, time travel? So now I'm Dr. Who? Or Doc Brown? For what class? I never got any cool time science homework. And I know this. I'll explain in detail later if you actually help me. Like, time, my texts are infinite. Plus, I have unlimited messaging. I'll make you a list of essential books and websites and movies. I'm intrigued by your new sci interest in science. Oh, so that was the email. You know I like sci-fi. Just think hard about it. Okay? Hit me up anytime if you have any other questions. I'll be in the TARDIS getting my DeLorean ready. Ooh, the references. We're so we're going, we are so going ape. Newburgh is 60 miles, so we should have, we should leave around five. I drive. Healthy, yeah. We will, we will, uh, we will in your new ride. We have to get supplies to the drive-in. Maybe we can have dinner first? That's a thought. Or whatever. Anyway, go away. Too late. Smiley face. Oh my gosh. This poor kid. He likes her so much and. Okay, run. Wow, sir. That looks exactly like the oh. same dough from my tornado vision. I think you can notice. That dough is the perfect photo op. Well, take a photo then. It, it, it's definitely... I probably won't even show. It's so... Dynamic range. Uh, let's look at that. It doesn't even show up. Is she gonna comment on that? It didn't show up in the picture. I feel like I shouldn't even be up here. I don't think there's a bottle over here. Why can't we explore this though? I don't think we can go back here. I really don't. Okay, back down we go. Dang, so we came over here for that and the car. I think there's probably a bunch of bottles over here. Okay, that was it. So let's go look in this way. Or not, I think I went the wrong way. 
Ew, what is that noise? Ooh, that doll is messed up. Do you see that? Aw, oh, poor thing. They left you here all alone. Car wreck again. Every car has its own tale and history. Um, hey Chloe, can you help me? She's not helping me find anything. Why do we need that? Do we need that? Huh. I could use this board as a bridge. Doesn't look too heavy. Then move it. Oh, syringe. Oh my gosh. Oh, gross. That's not so good. disturbing to see old syringes on the ground. Don't touch those. Don't touch those. Okay, what do we need the plank for? To get on the boat? Oh, we have to I bet I could get on the boat from a higher location. Really? How do we get up there? I'm lost. Oh, there's a there's a area. This looks like a graffiti museum for Chloe and Rachel. Well, this must be their hangout. I bet I can find out more about Rachel here. Why would I ride on it? I don't want to intrude, but I was here. And no, we're not gonna ride on it. I feel like she'd get mad at us. So Rachel did go to a Vortex Club party. This flyer is dated right before she disappeared. That's a weird. Okay, paper. I want to die. Jeez. Who wrote this? I couldn't have said it better myself, Max. Who did write that? Who take? Three down, two more go. Talk about uh, finding a bottle in the haze. Okay, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna look at that. I can't see Chloe playing with makeup. Isn't she wearing makeup right now? Or maybe I just assumed. Oh, pizza. Or not pizza? What's on that? They really were besties. That could have been me instead of Rachel. Why is she so hung up on this? Just be you are gone. She can just like you said, I get two friends. She can have friends. That kinda hurts. Girl, you were gone Oops. for five years. Okay, Rachel, Chloe. Oh, wow, Rachel was good. Okay, so how do we get up on that boat? I'm confused by that. Maybe I have to ask Chloe for help. Hey, Chloe, help me. I have to find dirty <laughs> bottles while you chill. That's true, not, not fair. I have to prep the range, crybaby. And I've been tripping hard about where you got this rewind power. From God. You said, what about her? The gods. So, bow. We can make the world bow. Are you ready for that? We're not making the world. No way. No way. No way. I still don't even know how my power works or for how long. Dude, you f up, you rewind, you fix it. Drop the mic. Boom. Doesn't Spin she understand it hurts her? I'm just altering time and space. Oh, yeah, and history. Make yourself <laughs> no so over here. You already altered history by saving my life, smart ass. Let's see what else you can do. I don't need to prove myself. Can you help me? I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. Was that a clue? I'm confused. Maybe, oh, oh, I didn't see this hill. Oh, there's a football. It looks really deflated. Bigfoot's were here. Um. Yeah, give me that plank. Way heavier than I thought. Ugh. Okay, give me that bottle. Chloe has a bottle, so I don't think we have to look for all five. One this more works. bottle to go. No, there is no more bottles. I already looked everywhere. <gasps> Kate, no, I'm sorry. Um, Max, sorry to have to bother you by asking you for advice. I guess I shouldn't do anything but let people enjoy my video all over the world. Kate, this is not what I meant. That is not what I- so not what I meant. I just want to be careful. I just want you to be careful. Wow, I read that whole thing wrong. Too late, I guess. But thank you for answering my call this morning. I really needed a friend and you delivered. I'm on your side. XO, talk to you later. That's the point. She's going through so much. Chloe had the nerve. The nerve. 
That makes me so mad. I think that's it. Um, let's go do stuff for Chloe. Give me that bottle. I'm you have shooting one. range while you look for some bottles. Give me that bottle. <laughs> that's my Chloe. What the heck? There's one more bottle I have to get. Where? Oh, mixtape. I didn't even see that. Rachel songs. I wonder if Chloe would ever make me a mixtape. Girl, really? Really? Why is she so gung ho on Chloe? I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. Girl. Campfire. How was I supposed to know this was here? How? How was I supposed to find this? I'm sure this is a popular party pit. Take that bottle. Take it right now. I don't know why Chloe's being selfish. Voila. Now I can deliver this bottle booty to Captain Chloe. I have to rewind now. Calm down. So we have to do it at the dot. Hey, how do you stop it? Do we get the bottle? Three, four, five. Yeah, we do. So let's get out of there. Why was she so upset about that? Chloe, here's your bottle. Excuse me, squirrel. Where is she at? She does not make me happy. You have that bottle? Bottles. Thanks, Max. She's drunk, you can tell. Wait, one more for the road? Jesus, stop drinking. You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Max, you have to help me aim. How? Show me the way, Max. I need to see you shoot first. Yeah. To the right. Show me the way, Max. Aim a bit to the right. Sir, yes, sir. Oh, yes! Did you see that, Max? Duh. That this is so, so useless. Cool. There's now no point why I use my, my powers for this. Now, Max, where do I aim? Shoot! You're on target. Pull the trigger. Um. Uh. Now, Max. This is making. Do I aim? She's aim making above. her sick. Right between the eyes. You can tell. Watch out, Nathan. Now that is fun. Let's pump up the volume and find me another target. I want to get creative here. Girl, shoot the bottles. Give me something to shoot, Max. The blue plank. The rim? Hello, what should I shoot? Stop! Give me- shoot that! I that old blue plank here. I hate old planks. Yawn. Um. I must rid the world of those bottles. Why would I go back? She's sick. Give me something to shoot, Max. Shoot. That. Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now? It's gonna. I was gonna oh, say that's gonna ricochet. Nice shooting, Tech. Now that's what I'm talking about. Satisfied? <laughs> like never? So I want one more uber cool trick shot. How about using that junker for a target now? That's gonna ricochet! It looks old! They're made of metal! Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Shoot the I windshield. See that windshield go down. Watch out for flying glass. <gasps> you guys better run for cover. 
Yet the bottle remains. So I have to. She's not. The Dude, gas I need a target push. before I shoot. Let's shoot the tire. How about aiming for the left tire? Adios, spinning wheel of death. Holy Uber hell. Cool. I cannot believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero. Now it's your turn to bust a cap. She's not okay. Look at her. I don't know. Max, your nose. Damn. I don't feel so super. Max! Why does she push her so hard? Oh, dang. I don't know why she pushes her so hard. Wait, there's more. Next. Just when I thought we couldn't get crazier, Chloe took me to her secret lair, the city dump, perfect for Halloween. Like where the vehicle and appliance ghosts of Arcadia Bay come to rot and rust. Urban dystopia. But instead of taking cool pit photos, Chloe had me do some silly kind of fun gun tricks. Yeah, she doesn't care about you. She just cares what you could do to benefit her. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? No, I think you. Thanks for helping me. Just give me a minute. Too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. This is kind of fun. Scary and stupid, but It's fun. not fun. Let me know when you feel okay. God, this power really messes with my head. I'm glad I feel normal again. What do I do? I better go chat up Chloe. Let's look at her first. <laughs> look at her. Chloe can even chill out playing with a gun. That's not okay. I don't think she's safe with that. I don't I don't trust her with that. Okay. Looks like you're ready to lock and load. She's not, but okay. I don't know about this. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? I don't like oh, it. Oh, boo-hoo. Max is afraid. I know you can handle this. And I'm here to guide you. <sighs> Make me proud, sister. I don't want to shoot it. Who is that? Is that Nathan? Hey. It's Thelma and Louise. No, Where's it's the, the guy Bonnie from Party and Clyde. Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute that you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not okay. anything alike, man. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? That's who she owes money You'll to. Get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough. What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend. And it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now. That's and Rachel's I... bracelet. Why the f are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. Give it to me right now, I You better step back before you regret it. Oh! I mean it. You want me to cut you Please, please step Max. back. You're kidding. Put that down. Don't shoot. We're not gonna. We're not gonna kill somebody. Come on, girly. Shoot me. Ah, oh, Christ. You're more like Abbott and Costello. Why would you shoot somebody? Nice piece. I'll consider this interest on your loan. Thanks. You have until Friday to pay me. Really, the bad idea. Down with this interest. Have a good play, kids. Now she's gonna be mad at me because we don't have the gun anymore. Just watch. Just watch. You we know Chloe. stood your ground. I freaked. So it's her. I don't like guns. Jeez. It'll be hard to keep Nathan off my ass. My step will have his other guns. Tell me about it. Bunker by now. Sorry, Chloe. I've never held she a gun. She doesn't deserve to have a gun anyway. Before. Seriously. Not cool. Leave her alone. I know, Max. Really. I'm actually relieved it worked you out. Yeah, you better start. 
She better start recognizing, you know? And there are more guns out there. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. I mean, can you blame him when you someone owes you money? Oh, man. Man. Frank took Chloe's gun because of me. We're not rewinding. Where'd she go? This way? Oh yeah, she did. Chloe's wow, sir. Why did Frank have Rachel's bracelet? We need to talk about this later, but I better follow Chloe now. I'm really I'm literally right here. Okay, they leave the junkyard. I can't believe you basically gave him my gun. Just goes again. Why? Why? You can't keep getting mad at me. Seriously. Stupid Seriously. Mad. It adds up in my mind as people letting me down. And I just liked having that gun, man. She's a terrible now friend. Now you have me to protect you. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could stay forever. Can we oh, build I'm... another pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? Um, Frank. Seriously, Chloe, this is scary. Oh, sorry, I looked up there. I, there was a what message. What if Frank tries to track us down? I'm sorry, but Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and rangy dog. Chloe, my back are you hurts. Reels. Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. I, Max, I know. I, I don't know. Crazy so shit just... is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without going on between you and Sorry Tom. to interrupt them, but Does I have food, have last so I'm sorry if I Frank make too Bowers. much noise. Obviously don't get my pot from you, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Hung out? Hung out? You don't mean you... Ah, oh, no, we didn't have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? How old's no. Chloe? I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? That's true. Be careful. I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy. Without him eyeballing us, okay? Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens, and it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Oh. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I, I wonder... know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. I Real hope she's always okay. make me feel better. I have no idea why. But... Yes, Carol, people have a limited know. time. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at night. Look at the beat poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. Perfect. Ah! Hold on. Yeah, we saw it in the preview. I should remember this happened. Mm, mm. What's that oh. noise? The train. Oh no. We're going to ask him. Um. Um. Push a lever. Damn it. can't even move it an inch. Open. Awesome. It's not locked. I better find a tool to cut those wires. You're kidding me. 
Oh my get me out of here! Oh. Calm down! I'm trying my best. Oh no. I know! Where's the door? I can't budget at all. You're kidding me. The train's coming! Max, please! Crowbar. Max, get me out of here! I can definitely use this bad boy. Please! Shit. We need to rewind it way back. That work. Come on, Max. Hurry. I know. Oh my God. Come on. Score. Get me out of here. Ah. Please get me out of here. Stop it. Score. Go in. Open. Mm. Yes, bingo. Right there. Okay. Now I can pull a total MacGyver. Max, get me out of here! Stop it. Let's go back. Okay, open. Okay, okay, okay. Hi. Which wire to cut? Max, please! Um! Rib! Max, give me now out that's here. the right tool. Oh! Heck yeah, not good. Cool. Yes! I did it! Hey! Hey! You okay? You saved me again. Crazy. It will not be that easy next time. Now we're totally bonded for life. Damn. That was close. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate no! spot? No! It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have okay. to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. Seriously. That's okay. We will. Forever. Not just he's acting foolish like this. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Snow equals the ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? What do you know? What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five years ago, I Some people change. True. And your situation True. is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So True. let's party with your power, Rockstar. No! Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a sh week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. Okay, time to walk in. This is the Moop Bay channel. I gotta stop eating. I'm hungry. You know I'm hungry. It's going on like three, almost four hours. Uh, filming? I'm hungry. Okay, not much is going on. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wondering. Okay. Ooh, look so at that vortex club party. Let's look at him first. I, I swear, Principal Wells always looks distressed. 
sir? Oh, hello, Max. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. Alleged? Nathan did have a gun. Have you talked to him yet? Yes, he's deeply upset about this accusation. I don't blame him. I'm not. Once I have all the facts, we'll talk. For the moment, focus on your schoolwork. Okay. I can't focus when I'm scared. Mm -hmm. Please don't say that. There's nothing to be scared of at Blackwell Academy. Our head of security is overseeing a new era of campus safety. Mmm. He did. I saw Mr. Madsen hassle Kate Marsh yesterday. Wait, wait. Do you see a pattern here, Max? Probably not the same one you see. It's yeah. very easy for you to instantly accuse people of doing terrible things. Nathan, Mr. Madsen, who's really? next? Now, if you'll excuse me, really? I have a meeting. Oh. Typically, I thought. Never mean? Shoo! Shoo! Mm-mm. That's cute. Not him. The pumpkin. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, if I was normal, I'd be super excited about going to a major shindig. Hmm. Justin, right? Justin always looks stoned. Probably because he is. I wonder if that's why he remembers. Hmm. Posters everywhere. Missing person poster. We saw this already. Zachary. Zachary always looks like he's ready to throw a football. He does. Hello, Zach. Sup, Max? It's weird to not see you without your camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sext in Victoria. It's over. Uh, I so bad don't like him. Because you did. You sex. But I want everyone to be on my good side. I want them to believe they can talk to me. I won't. That's what Victoria wanted. Yeah. I noticed she kind of set up her own drama. Even if it fucked her over. Weird. She doesn't have to, though. That's what I don't get at all. She's hot, rich, talented. What more does she need? Anyway, see you at the game Friday, Max. I never like going to the games. What makes you think I'm gonna? That snow was so insane. Seriously. Hello, climate change. Why do you sound like Alyssa? Ooh, can I go through? Wow. Let's talk to. Can I talk to him? I wanna talk to Samuel. Okay, oh, look who's running this. If I was normal, I'd be super excited about going to a major shindig. Yeah. Uh, look. Join us, or die. Yeah, we're good. We're not gonna join. Let's look Courtney at her. Courtney will do anything for Victoria and the Vortex Club. Let's see if we can get her to be kind of nice hey, to us. Like... Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I don't want to take a picture. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you Excuse care. Excuse me. I do. I I'm don't, but I do. I'm not anti-soiree. You seem anti-fashion, though. Wow. The Vortex Club party wow. has a strict dress code. Tell me, and I'll do, do it. Do you even have a dress? Yes. <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. Wow. Okay, so we can talk to her. Speak. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. Skip. Really? Oh, like you care. Dress code? I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. As you can see, I would need your advice on what to wear. Oh, nice, Max. Yes, nice. Max? I didn't think you noticed high fashion. Tell you what, I'll put you down on the guest list, and before the party, I can give you some tips. Oh, cool. okay. Thanks, Courtney. I'll send you the party info later. Back to the list. If we get to that, we could probably... We could probably catch Nathan doing some suspicious stuff. Oh, here's Trevor. Trevor surveys his domain. Ooh! It's David. 
Okay, let's let's see if he has anything to say to me. If only I knew what David Madsen was really up to. <gasps> he didn't know we were there. Did he? No. Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? Do you mind if we talk about what happened yesterday with Chloe? I guess. Wait. Back up. I don't remember him knowing we were there. You hit her. You hit Chloe. I'm sure she told you Oh, why. so he doesn't know we were there. Did she mention she probably stole one of my guns? You're a mm, combat veteran. Maybe. She's no threat to you. That doesn't if mean I anything. I didn't care about her. I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. Uh, all wait. you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. Uh, what about Kate? What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Excuse me? Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Justice for Kate. Max, Sorry. this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, well, you're including you. That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with I'm you fighting. anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna leave her. I'm hot. I think I ate enough of you, Len. Oh, this is all happening one day. That's crazy. Hey, girl. Sit down. Science. Something. <coughs> Almost died. I'm in the sci-fi lab now. I'm no longer Schrodinger's kitty. See you soon. Okay, so they have a good relationship. Okay. So. Okay. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Until the guy Chloe owes money to showed up, some skeevy guy called Frank. Oh, I read that wrong. Until the guy owes money to... Until the guy Chloe owes money to showed up, some skeevy guy named Call... Named Call? Guy named... Frank. He demanded Chloe pay him back, or else. I was shocked that he wasn't the loan shark I had expected, but I could literally feel his bad vibe. I still can't see how my best friend ended up involved with a loser like Frank. Things got truly crazy when Frank took Chloe's gun, or should I say David's gun? And now we had to worry about one more lunatic after Chloe, and maybe me. Chloe really flipped out when she saw that Frank was wearing one of Rachel Amber's bracelets. What me- That means he definitely- We definitely have another suspect. This is so not how I intended to expend my time in Arcadia Bay. After all that drama, ma- Drama. Oh, after all that drama, Rama volume XXII, I, Chloe and I ended up talking, taking a walk along the tracks deep in the woods. We both needed to hear something, nothing but the sounds of nature and wildlife. I was shaking inside from our encounter with Frank, and though Chloe fronts, though I could tell she was shaken too. She told me everything about Frank, which explains why she was trying to blackmail Nathan. It shocks me that she, the girl I grew up with, watching SpongeBob, ended up. So, such a scary in such a scary orbit still i felt safer with her at my side and i was glad we had a moment of peace so it probably was the best idea to lay down on the tracks and wax about life etc as chloe's leg got caught in the rail just as the goddamn train showed up of course i was off trying to take a photo for my portfolio then i had another quick flash of uh, my tornado vision i could see it almost feel it tearing the sky apart my head felt like it was exploding like in the 90s film scanners just as fast as vision came it disappeared i may be in denial about what this apocalypse image means or doesn't then i heard chloe screaming for help and i was something kittens <laughs> her foot was stuck in the damn rail and naturally the train was coming around the mountain I was pretty proud of myself for coming up with a drastic, if not destructive, solution of, to saving Chloe once again. But just in case this journal ever falls into the wrong hands, it's going to remain our BFS secret. So there. Our morning adventure over, 
Our morning adventure over, Chloe dropped me off back at the campus. She was so sweet and said that this had been the best week of her life, despite everything. That made me feel so awesome. Chloe really sees us like we're taking over the world, but what if I hadn't been able to use my rewind power to get her off that track? Chloe might have to lower her expectations. So will I. That's true. That is true. Chloe needs to stop acting like Max is always going to be there. Frank. I'll never forget Frank, if only because he's the first and last person I will ever aim a gun at. How did Chloe end up in this sketchy drug dealer's orbit? The weird thing is that when I first saw him threatening Chloe in the junkyard, I was more shocked how uncreepy he looked. What? I expected some try-hard gangster, oh, but he looked more like a dumpster-diving troll, which I guess he kinda is since we're on his turf, testing out our rewind skills for Chloe's amusement. Though he didn't look like a serial killer, his vibe, aura, energy, whatever, was bad. I could literally feel the hair on my arms prickling. He wanted the money Chloe owed him, so it didn't t it didn't make sense he would hurt her, but I wasn't going to take a chance. So yes, I actually threatened him with David's gun. Ridiculous. Fortunately, none of us ended up like reservoir dogs, and I saw that maybe Frank isn't as scary as I thought, but I don't want Chloe near him ever again, since he was wearing one of Rachel Amber's bracelets for what the F or WTF reasons, I doubt Chloe will be partying with him anymore, but he's at the top of our su suspect list right now. Yes, I can't blame I you. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. I don't see why not. Uh, Luke? Oh, we did talk to Luke. Luke is always using the phone as a shield to avoid people. I mean, I can't blame him. Oh. That reminds me, I have oh. to score some weed from Nathan. Juliet is laying the smack down on Zachary. Ooh. Locker, that's ours. I hate having everybody see inside my locker. What? What? Is it the same? Yeah, it is. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. <laughs> okay. Oh, my ash. <laughs> I, oh, you can't see her. My ash is laying. Up. My ash. My my ash. Her name is Ash. Uh, she, my cat's laying down next to me. I love how Evan is so above the Vortex Club and everything else. Mm. Yo, Maxwell Smart. Talk later, cool? Yeah, oh, I forgot he likes us because we went back in. Okay. So you can't help me? I'm trying, but you have to understand my position. <gasps> Kate, Kate, no, 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 talk to me. You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Nobody. I do, oh my gosh. No, Kate, 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 follow her. Stop! Don't come near me. Okay. What did you say to her? Ooh. Ooh, I oughta, I oughta. I'm gonna see Warren first and then, then me and you. Ooh. Is this where Warren's at? Yes. I can tell because of science stuff. Yeah, there he is. Okay, let's look around. Real quick. Poor Kate. Kate does not deserve- what'd he do? You would think teachers would, I don't know, be more respectful. She's going through something. Not teachers, him, him specifically. Him in this movie as a teacher. Movie, in this game as a, a teacher. Not Brooke all teachers, always kind of pretends like I'm almost not there. Why? Because Warren likes you and she likes Warren. Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. Making your daily rounds? Of course. Drone. How is your drone? Miss Grant busted me flying it over the parking lot. What's wrong with that? She's all jacked up about surveillance oh. bullshit. Like I was spying on Warren's new car. You already planted a GPS on him? I borrowed the one he has on you. What? This can't one, be that but... hard. Don't let me get in your way. So long. Do you hear Warren in the background? Do you hear him? This can't be so hard. Let's go ask. Oh, let's talk to her. She's all- Oh, Graham. I bet if I touch the glass, all these creepy sea critters will pop up. I doubt it. I doubt they're just, I think they're just regular fish. Okay. Why can't I get up there? Look. Miss Grant is so cool and smart. She defines the word teacher. Yeah, she seems nice. Hi, Miss Grant. Funny, I was just thinking about you, Max. Were you? It's too bad you didn't sign the petition. Every signature counts. I, I agree. We should and have yours might cameras. be the one that decided. Let's be real. What if that? If we had those cameras out, what if they caught Nathan with the gun? Like, what if he still had it when he got out? Like, let's be real. Photos? What's that? I'm mean? just thinking about all the autumn photos I want to take. 
Oh, this is my favorite time of year. I do love the season change. I agree. I can't wait. This it's hot right now. This whole campus is a visual delight. I know Mr. Jefferson loves to shoot around here. Hmm, you know Jefferson, you like for talk. Yeah, you know Jefferson. I don't know more you about him. You must know Mr. Jefferson pretty well by now. I certainly know him as a talented artist and terrific teacher. I've been here a little longer, but he's made a bigger mark. Why? Though? I have because to say, it's not quite autumn enough yet. Oh, snow, yeah. What about that snow yesterday? What's your scientific explanation? Yeah, our climate is moving beyond explanation. Of course, some of the tribes here might see it different. That's true. I, I, this is kind of like what's going on right now. Let's be real. Like, places are getting more floods or places are getting rain and flooded than they never done, gotten it. Like, my town that I live in, we get rain every so often, but it rained so badly uh, just last week, I think. Last week or a week and a half ago or something. And it flooded our town. I have not seen that in a long time. How is your campaign going it's missing somebody who should care but no finger pointing in i'm back. not signing it more people would rather send a text than sign a petition girl that's how they keep us all distracted nobody will notice cameras on every square foot i think they'll be some helpful. of us want to use our cameras for good that's true but people like david mattson want to use them to spy okay but where's he gonna put them i'm not like him they should be able Graham. to see where he puts them i know them. max but the trick is to make sure Blackwell Academy does not end up like him. I'm sorry, Miss Grant, but you know? I have to get going. Well, Go on, Max. Off. We'll talk again. Real soon. Will we? Okay, so we looked at that. I wish I could bring a mini Warren with me to my science exams. I don't know. He seems to be struggling right now. Let's go talk to him. Oh, Warren seems so nice. Bring me the brain, Igor. There's Mr. Wizard, hard at work. I was talking. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. <laughs> you have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. What are you doing, though? Sodium, potassium, sodium, potassium, sodium, potassium, sodium. I have a vision. Go diem. Go diem? That's the worst pun I've ever heard. Don't worry me! Yet Max has spoken. Sodium it is? I don't know what you're doing. That's gonna backfire. Damn. Zip. Nothing. Hang it up. Hey, what? Max, ask him. Have that. Uh, potassium then. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide oh. your fate, but go potassium. Potassium it shall be. If this works, you get a Godium free hug. Godium is better. Get a free hug? He really likes her. Weird science. Was that it? Um. Yes, I am a scientist. That was it? So, okay. Cool. I, I need to get to class. Skeleton! wonder why they don't use real skeletons. There's a reason they don't use real skeletons. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson, what did you say to my girl Kate? I bet Mr. Jefferson has had to deal with a lot of troubled students. You see him? He, she left and he's still looking down that corridor. He's suspicious. Excuse me, Max. Can you come over here? Sure. Yeah. You look yeah. worried. Is everything okay? No. Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. Ooh. I don't care about that but right now. Notice. So what can I do for you, Max? Oh, uh, what did you say to Kate? Me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. Yes, he was bullying her. Yeah, I'll say his I name. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face mm -hmm. about something. Mm -hmm. She doesn't deserve that. She doesn't. Of course not. Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Yeah, we know this. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough. <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. I should say I didn't take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max, I, I promise guess. this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I guess. I assume you know about this viral video. 
Kate is freaked out. Kate is freaked out by all of this. I guess we could have rewinded she it. She can't and, do homework yeah. while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She <laughs> means well, but maybe she doesn't protest too much. No, he did she not. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to yes, her? Yes, I have. Yes. Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. Seriously, how dare you say I that? I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With what was all that reaction? the person's posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. We guys just gossip, huh? That was private. That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you. No, I wouldn't tell you. This is a serious accusation. Hey, but he so you don't believe me? I would never make something like, like this. I'm like, this is why I don't tell you guys anything. I'd like to believe that, Max. It just seems like there's a lot of drama around you this week. Yeah, Listen, she would know. Should I? Excuse me, Max. Hello. Yes? Um, uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Hmm. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Sure, okay. Listen, I do have a class I have to teach. I have to go. Huh, you can't hear the other person, but... Okay, I'll do that. Oh, it, I know. That makes sense. Huh. Okay. Seriously, I have to hang up now. No, keep talking. Let's talk about this later. I have to go. That his wife? Husband? Because I can't have this conversation. Go for boyfriend. Okay, will you please just hang up the phone? Partner? Hi, Stella. Stella Friends is smart to stay out of all the drama. But she's for, she needs to be there for a friend. Tina, you are out of control. Turn left, then right. Oh, Show he did. The love. How do I love Ooh, can we see on his computer? Really? We can't see on his computer? We already saw this. Oh, look, it's our girl Alyssa. Oh, take a photo of her. Okay, now let's look and then speak. Resolution. Alyssa really revolution. lives for her classes. Okay, let's Not speak now, to Max. I'm contemplating. Okay, sorry. Daniel, he drew us. Ooh. Daniel is always on the outside looking in. What's up, Daniel? Waiting to draw Dana after Hayden gets his paparazzi on. I hope you liked the sketch I did of you yesterday. It was good. No, not embarrassed. Whoa. And it's my new avatar. Excellent. I got tons of likes on FB. Ah, uh, made you blush. <laughs> Shut up. He is nice. Someday your portrait may hang in the Daniel de Costa wing of the Louvre. We'll talk about it later. Okay. Oh, drawing. What are you showing? That's a great sketch of Dana. <gasps> Daniel is the real deal. Who is this down here? <laughs> Who is that? Okay. Ooh. Okay, let's talk to them first. Oh, I'm in the way. Let's talk to them first. It's hard to not like Hayden oh. because he just doesn't give a shit. He doesn't. I I'm feel like he's just... doing something now, Max. Uh, well, can I talk to you, Dana? Dana is ready for her 15. I'm just in the background of these pictures. No time to talk, Max. Posing in progress. Go past Do you think them. Max will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? No. Oh, I'm sure she'll report us to the principal. Oh, really? Like I give a flying f I'm right she'll here. She'll run to Mr. Jefferson like he gives a shit. I like me. Taylor's Trust artistic side, Max not her personality. Little... No time to talk, Max. Art in progress. Hey! I can't believe the principal lets him stay in school after I told him what happened. Ooh, I'm gonna talk to you. be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. Oh, Did you no, think liar. we were best friends forever or something? No. Not at all, Victoria. 
Yeah. Max is such an attention whore. Am I? You would know. Can I sit down? Right, now? you would know. Oh, please do. Take a selfie of this moment. Okay. Yeah, Max. So I won't forget you. Okay. Ooh, seriously, they make me mad. I guess that's it. Wait, where are they? I didn't talk to Victoria. Ass. Oh, look at his face. He has scratch marks on his face. Why? Well, while we're waiting, I'm gonna finish eating because I am hungry. Eight. Okay, why is Whoa. David taking photos of Kate? Uh -uh. Now this is so wrong and mm -mm. weird. Mm-mm. 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 Oh, warm. Mm-mm. I don't like that. What up, Max? Hey, Hi, Warren. Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from mm -hmm. crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. <laughs> Hello, for Everybody her. else, please sit down. I've a lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. I she see all the her. usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. He Maybe has no a see. student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false he images. He literally of you. false images of you. Yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. Chloe. No smartphones in class, Max. Put that away. Sorry. Usually, people need something. It's cool that Mr. Jefferson published his own little book of photos. So tips. they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. I can't blame him for he said he's Speaking being right. Wait, he was he, he let her walk. He knows where she's at. Get to enter a photo in the contest. I know you're looking like at me. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Uh, who I know can't wait to enter, right? Yeah. I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today. Wait, what's going on? Kiro Skiro. You hear? That beautiful word about Maybe the contrast just between busy. light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrasts. Although we don't technically see in my Yo! Some crazy is going down at the girl's dorm! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. No! Listen, everybody remain seated. Yeah, I'm going too. Dismissed. Uh What's going on? Is this for real? Flipped out. I didn't think she was that messed up. No, no way, no way, no. Let me walk. I swear to God. Who is that up there? Oh my God! Oh no! Is that not again? Not now. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. No way. Oh my gosh. I knew it. Something was going to happen. She's using it too much. It's in slow-mo. Oh my god. Did we break the power? Nathan, I don't like you. Why is everyone just watching her? Keep. Victoria has her phone out. Max, go. Yeah. Go. Can. Go. Do it. Go. Go. You're not going to go fast? Okay. Okay, so I can't. Why? Really? Where? Which way do I go? Okay, so I have to go this way. I can't walk faster than this? Excuse me, y'all are helping. You guys are just taking pictures and what is wrong with them? At least David trying to, I don't like him, but at least he's trying to get up there. Excuse me, coming through, really slowly, but coming through. Oh my gosh, 
No, 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 no. We need to get to her right yes. now. Talk to her. My heart is pounding. Not Kate. What? Kate, call her. Call her. Call her. Call her. Call her. You're not going to be able to rewind. What are you doing here, Matt? I care about Stop. you. Don't come near me. Not now. It won't work. I don't have any power. Now I have to do this by myself? Max, seriously, don't come near me. I will jump. Okay, I won't come near okay, you. Okay, okay. I'm right here. Kate, please. Oh, Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. Nothing matters. Oh, no, 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 no. Things will get better. You matter, not just to me. You matter, not just to me. You matter. And not just to me. Yeah. I do want to believe that. Kate, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. Like I helped by erasing all that crap people wrote on your room slate. Yeah. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. Okay, okay. You're my friend. I'm here for you. You're my friend. Of course I worry. You're my friend, Kate. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always feel like you really listen. This better- Kate, we better be able to save her. trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. It was. That's your story now. How can I trust you? Mm. What about this morning when I needed help? You I know. told me to do nothing. Well, I, I, yeah. I'm gathering proof. Too dangerous for us. I wasn't sure. I needed more time. I'm gathering proof. Kate, I'm gathering Is that the right proof choice? that Nathan Prescott drugged you. And you're not the only victim. So you have to help me take Nathan down. Ooh. Nathan Prescott? That makes sense. He's a scumbag. I don't have proof you now. You have proof now? I don't. Soon. Then straight okay. to the police. Yes. Think of it like we're cleansing Blackwell. Exactly. You do have my back, Max. That's the first time I've felt hopeful in a week. Oh, poor Kate. Good. We all need to have each other's backs. So, I want you to come with me now. Please. You don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to no, sleep. No, no, no. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my no, body. No, definitely not. on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. There are billions of videos. Everybody will forget. Be strong. Ooh. Not everybody will forget. I don't think she'll like that. You know? Be strong. Billions are... I want to say there are billions of videos. I think be strong to her. I feel like she wouldn't like that. Kate, there are billions of videos out there. Yours will fade away like white noise. Oh God, please, Max. You haven't seen the looks I get. I know, I know. Or the laugh. I understand, truly. She does. I get bullied too. But this is a blip. Yep, my life is a blip. Blackwell oh no, taught me oh I'm no, worthless. Oh no, 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 you can't do this to all the people who care about you. No. Nobody cares about me. What about your Nobody. Your sisters. Your sisters. Not your mother or your father. Your si she's a half brother. She has sisters. I saw that cute photo of you with your sisters in your room this morning. I can see how much your little sister loves you by her smile. That's Lynn. She's only 10. She does have the best smile ever. I would hate to see her sad. She would be sad. Then make Lynn happy and step towards me. If she was here, you would know what to do. This isn't the end, Kate. There's no way God doesn't have big plans for you here. Oh, nice no. Nice try, Max. But God put me on this roof. No. Suicide is a sin, no. Proverbs, Matthews. Proverbs or Matthews? This was an arrival. Proverbs, Matthews. I think it's Matthews because in Pro she scratched up Proverbs. I remember Matthews. I swear, I swear. Come to me, 
all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Matthew eleven twenty eight. I can't believe you quoted one of my oh, favorite okay. passages. Okay. Like I said, I care about you. I know this passage means a lot to you. Come on, Kate. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. No, you don't need to be sorry. Oh my gosh, Kate. What are you talking about? You saved me from talking in class. <laughs> oh, poor Kate. Was there actually an option for her to... I hope not. Now, I know today was difficult for everybody, but I'm so proud of the way Blackwell pulled together to save a young girl's life. We saved her life. Of course, you're quite a hero for getting Kate to come down, Max. Of course. I didn't do much. She's modest. Like a real hero. Yeah. Real hero. What? As principal of Why Blackwell Academy, that? I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. Do you? Because you'd be bullied today for... should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always yeah, be don't get locked. Mad at me. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not. And that is indeed your responsibility. Why is Nathan here? Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through. But Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. You should have too! Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex That's Club why he's parties, here. and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Wait, what? I'm here. I saved her. Why else am I here Ms. for? Miss Caulfield. Oh. Why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? To save her? Did she tell you her plan? No. Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. Jefferson made her cry. Nathan dosed her. David bullied her. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I would like to see Nathan Doster, but we have no proof, so there's no point. We already tried doing something with that. I want to say Jefferson made her cry, and that's why she went out there. So you got worried, and you checked. Sorry, Mr. Jefferson, but I, I have to. I saw Mr. Jefferson talking to Kate right before our class. Then she ran off crying. Mark, I do know that Miss Marsh has assisted you on class events. Oh, Kate, he looks betrayed! Miss Marsh has been very withdrawn lately. I assume this awful video was the cause. I hated seeing the students laugh at her. She told me Max was the only one who believed her, would take her calls and actually listen to her. Mm -hmm. She shouldn't have asked to be on video, Mackin with some dude. Ooh. She didn't ask for anything. Exactly. Of this. No, on the contrary. Max was right to bring this up. Mm -hmm. Now, I wanted to help, but I guess I was too late. Well, now this is problematic. Okay, Jefferson, okay. The publicity is rising and perhaps. You shouldn't represent Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes oh, contest whoa, whoa, whoa. in San Francisco. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you I, serious? We didn't want that to happen. I am. We don't need any negative press about that. But he event. didn't do anything. It's Nathan and that's the issue. And we need issue. to involve the Academy in possible disciplinarian measures Can we fix for this? you. I'm not going back, but there are bigger things at stake than me. The life of a young girl, for one. Maybe you should investigate other staff members. Max told me she knew things about Mr. Madsen. Let Max speak for herself. Whoa, Everything what? we talked about Whoa, will be looked into. Why is he dragging me like All right, that? Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My mm -hmm. head is killing me, but I think I can use my power again. Why? Why would I do that? To get Jefferson to, to be in the committee? No, that's well, what happened. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. Should we talk about I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. You don't care. I don't think he cares, to be honest. Ooh, why does he have scratches on his face? You see that? He must have made someone mad and they slapped him. Oh, it was Chloe. I forgot. 
I'm just glad Kate's okay. I couldn't even believe it was happening. It was literally slow motion as I grabbed her hand, And then I could feel her grabbing mine. Max, that was the greatest thing I've ever seen. Ever! You reached out, she reached out, hugs, tears, applause, like a superhero. Yeah, but this is a serious Look situation. I'm a mess. You're glowing. Seriously, a human halo. I'm pretty sure you earned your wings today. I'm still worried about Kate. She did try to kill herself. It's all not just all over video. a video. Viral is the right word. Like a disease. So you watched it? Just one. And a half times. What, Warren? Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. Yeah. So, what do you think is really happening? Mm. I feel like we could tell him if he gives me the option. What the hell is this? The weather confirms this weird day. In the eclipse? It feels that I, chill. Were they supposed to get yeah, an eclipse? There was no eclipse scheduled today. That is my know. question. I would. There, we only have so many days. Oh, oh, I believe you, Warren. Oh, Warren just I slid up. He took the chance. This week. He took the opportunity. Oh, oh. Okay, David. David and Joe. Oh, he went home. He must be talking about it. He. I don't think David's that bad. This sounds bad. I don't think David's that bad of a guy. He's just a little too much. And I think that's because his time in the military. Jefferson. And the principal. Why are they arguing? Jefferson really rolled up his window and drove away from him. Ooh, well, I wonder what they were talking about. Do you see this? That eclipse is big. Why is she crying? Victoria literally bullies people for the. Okay, Nathan and Victoria. Ooh, why do you smile? Ooh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Okay, Frank and his dog. I want to get to know the dog. <laughs> this is the dog. Okay. Oh, there's supposed to be music here. <laughs> uh, I don't have it. <laughs> okay. Oh. She's in the hospital. We should be able to check up on her, right? I want to be able to visit her so she knows that we're still there for her. I didn't check if we had any journal entries or not. I'll do that next time. Okay, this is Chloe. What does she have? She's smoking. Girl, you need to stop that. You need to stop it. Sorry about Kate, I hope you're okay. This eclipse speaks me out. Let's find out what's going on. Oh, it says right there, oops, together. Okay. Okay. Wait, I thought you weren't supposed to look at an eclipse straight on, and all these people are. <laughs> Rachel Kelly Lynn. Rachel Kelly Lynn. What is this? Let me close that back up. Kate? No! Whoa, whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Pills, alcohol, alcohol. No, that's a misdirect. That's a mister. There's no way. The only person I know who drinks is the principal. Out of time. Okay. 66% told Kate to wait for proof. Oh, I wonder what would happen if someone said go to the police. 81% answered Kate's call. Yeah, they better have. Let's take these off.
Oh wait, no, we need to watch the preview. Uh, wow, forty percent. You didn't try to shoot Frank. So people shot Frank. Dang, dang. Then we don't know the man. What if he's what if he's in the right? You know, sixty-three percent saved Kate's life. I hope. You know what I think? Some people was the random Bible verse, but I only remember it being in a Bible. Seventeen percent. You blamed Mr. Jefferson. Seventy-one percent blamed Nathan. I mean, I can understand blaming Nathan. Let me let me let me explain why I chose Mr. Jefferson because he had asked he had asked why we were um there he had asked why we were there at the the top of the roof and the only thing i can think of that's more that sounds more like oh that's why she's there is the fact that kate was talking to him and then she left and cried and then she ended up on the roof nathan did do something really bad which were oh it's which we're assuming because Victoria said something and stuff, but we don't know. And then he met up with somebody else to do do something with Kate. But it wasn't at that moment. So yeah, that's why I did that. Um, what is this? Oh, that was last episode. Okay. Next. Okay, next. You watered your plant. I Yeah? 60% you helped Allison. I didn't even know what happened until I read the toilet paper. Uh, you were friendly with Taylor, 46%. We gotta get some people on our side, you know? You know? You accepted Warren's invitation, 76%. Yeah, because that poor kid. You didn't write a message, 45%. Um, no, I... I That's their thing. Why? I will comment on that in a second. You didn't tamper with the rail track, 68%. Didn't tamper? Didn't tamper with the rail... What? You gained entry to the Vortex Club, 49%. I want to be in there. You didn't help Warren, 57%. What? I thought I did. Okay, apparently not. You told on David to Mr. Jefferson. 76%. Everyone did that. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Chaos of Theory. Ooh, so we see more of Frank's thing. We're in the school, I'm assuming, and Chloe's house. When it comes to people I'm okay with, these are the people I'm okay with. I like Kate. I like Samuel. I think he's just a little a weird, but I don't think he's done anything, to be honest. He had pictures of uh, Rachel, but he said, yeah, she was handing out headshots. So, yeah. And then we have, um, I like, so I like Kate, Samuel, Warren's pretty cool. I like Warren. These are people uh, I'm a little iffy about. Um, Jefferson is kind of weird to me. Now, I don't know if that's a misdirect, but honestly, I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this. I think they're trying to make Frank, Samuel, and the principal look like they did something. I don't know what, it, possibly with Rachel, with the files and stuff, because when they showed the files in this last one, it was Kate, and there was a drink. And who drinks? Who who does everyone know is alcoholic? The principal. But I don't think it's the principal. I think the principal's too. He, people walk on him too much. Talk, walk all over him too much. And you may think, oh, that may cause him to, you know, do these things, which I don't know what these things are. But I don't think he would go that far to whatever it is that you know to a missing person, you know, um, or with Kate and stuff. The one person I'm a little suspicious of is Mr. Jefferson. But I'm not at the same time. He's a little, he seems like, he seems like he cares. But at the same time, he seems like he will take back saying he cares in an instant, you know? Chloe, this is gonna be a controversial hot take. I know a lot of people like Chloe, um, um, and I'm not saying, you know, to each their own, if you like her, you like her. That's, if it's the character you like, you like that character. But I personally, not yet, I personally do not like her yet. Um, I think she has a lot to work on with herself. She has a lot of uh, trauma and a lot of like all this stuff that she needs to work on and needs to be like find peace with. And she takes her anger out and everything on everybody. But what makes me most mad about her is the fact because you can't you can't blame someone for that. She's going through a lot. But what, what bothers me about her, what makes me mad about her, is the fact that Max got this power and Max continues to tell her, "I don't know how long I'll have this power. I don't know how long I can use this power. Uh, it's making me have a headache. It's making me sick." And she saw it with the nosebleed twice 
not even twice i think it was more than that and she still continues to try to push her to do stuff useless stuff she just she seems to only care about herself and especially rachel now what bothers me with max is the fact that max has been gone for five years and she didn't even contact chloe when she got back and what is she doing this whole episode? She's going, man, that kind of hurts. And da, 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 with everything that her, that Chloe and Rachel did together, you weren't there. You can't you can't be upset or mad about something when you weren't there for it. You guys did stuff together, and I'm sure Rachel's like, oh, that's cool, you know. But to sit there and be like upset about something, one, you had no control. You moved, you moved. But two, Chloe's not gonna be by herself forever, you know. So that that kind of that kind of irritates me, but I get they're teenagers, they're still growing, they're still learning, you know, emotions, communication, all this kind of stuff. Um, Kate, I love her with all my heart. She's one of my favorite characters. Kate is one of my favorite characters. Um, I hope she's okay. I hope we see more of her. She's in the hospital. I'm assuming we can be able to go to see her and stuff like that. But with how short our time is limited, I doubt we'll be able to just visit her. I'm hoping we do, but I guess we'll see. But Frank. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I can't judge his character yet, to be honest. I can't. Um, Chloe owes him money. That's that, you know? Um, I feel like we'll see a lot more of him, though, because she does owe money and he has Rachel Amber's bracelet. That's a little weird, but he said it was gifted to him, and I feel like he wasn't lying. He seemed genuine when he said that. But so far, I'm a little... I'm a little confused when it comes to her powers, to be honest. No, the more things go on, I guess we'll see how I'll form my opinions on the characters a little more. Of course, I don't really like Victoria that much. She seems like she's going through her own stuff, though. And then we definitely don't like Nathan. But I, again, all these characters that I, I don't like or I'm a little oof about, they all have their issues. And they all have their own issues. And they're all, of course, going through something or there's something wrong with them. Not necessarily wrong, because there's nothing wrong with having issues, but... There's something that there's an issue with them that they haven't gotten checked or they haven't been able to get help for and so they're just taking on all they always take it on other people and it seems like that's a reoccurring thing um but uh, i don't know i don't know so far i like this episode um the it's it's gone more crazy and honestly it's gotten me more excited because the more time goes on the more I'm like, ooh, time is limited now. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta watch what we do carefully. But, uh, oh, another thing. I'm a little worried because Chloe said, uh, she had a sense of like our, our style. And then she said she has or whatever. That's kind of sad though, because most of the time they say they have to find what missing people within a certain amount of time, or there's no luck of them actually being, you know, alive or found again. And it's been what nine months since the since she's been missing. So, do I hope we find her? Yes, I really hope we do, so we can meet this character. She seems like a she seems like a genuine nice person, and I want to meet her so we can all be friends. But at the same time, I highly doubt she is. That sounds bad. I don't know. I don't know if you know what's going on with this game. I would like to hear your theories up to this point. Of course, you probably know more than me, but if you're going along the journey with me, I hope you enjoy it. And I hope you, if you notice anything, you point them out in the comments down below. I would love, love to hear it because I like to read the comments and see if there's anything new or anything that I missed that I can be like, oh, you're right, you know? But yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. And the next uh, video I'm going to be posting is going to be Little Nightmares 2 episode three, I believe. Episode three. And then... Uh, I don't know what happens after that and that one that one's a little weird But I talked more about that on that episode, but yeah, that's just letting you know what's gonna happen the next thing I post this one's gonna be Life is strange one episode two um, Yeah, but I hope you enjoyed I hope you come back for the next episodes for life is strange and little nightmares If you like both if you like one, that's okay. Come back for the one series um, These ones are a lot longer. Make sure you remember to get snacks anything to feel comfortable when you're watching this because it is a long long episode but yeah i hope you enjoyed and now it is water time now if you're new here this is a segment where i always get water and we drink it together you regardless of what you get it in it could be in anything a jar a cup a bowl a plate anything you just get a sip of water um get anything you want to drink honestly i should just water all the time because i always forget to drink water so this is whenever i film it seems good uh to have this because it reminds myself to drink water but also just in case you were like oh i didn't drink water today you know go ahead you know uh, there we go there there it is but yeah this is the segment where you drink water 
it could be a whole gulp it could be the whole bottle it could be just a sip something that's good for yours i'm not forcing you to drink it i'm not gonna force you how much to drink it i'm just reminding you that you probably should drink some water now if you want to drink with me go right ahead if you want to pause it and do it another time that is perfectly okay too you can do it whenever you feel comfortable but also if you don't feel like doing it with me and you want to do it on your own time that is perfectly okay this is just a daily reminder so here we go pause it whenever you'd like and just replay it whenever it's ready let's go that is good that is good but yeah that's gonna be it for today i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you it, it feel the same way when it comes to characters although i know certain people like certain characters and i don't like certain characters so um just tell me who you like down below in the comments let me know what your favorite character who your favorite character is let me know if you probably would have done something different in a situation because i think i'm doing pretty good so far but i might be doing all the wrong answers the only thing i'm happy with right now is the fact that i saved kate i don't know there was an option where you couldn't say i don't want to mention that i don't want to, i don't want to mention that but yeah that's gonna be it for today i hope you guys enjoy the video i hope you guys come back again for the next video and i hope you have a good day and i hope you have a good night adios